course. Of course. Of course I would love to get married to you. Dave. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for putting you through so much pain. I'm sorry. It's alright. Come here. It's alright, darling. Sorry. It's alright. It's alright. Okay? I'm so sorry. It's alright. Love is beyond what you see. Love is not just a way. Hey. Oh, babe. I've been in this house for too long. I need to go out to ease of stress. But, baby, you're not fit. Babe, it's a month already. I've been in this house a whole month. I'm tired. But, baby, remember the doctor said we need to rest. We both need to rest. And that's what we're doing. Resting. Babe. Is a month not enough time to rest? What are you saying? Baby. Okay. What if I don't want you to go out today? I'm going to be so lonely in this house without you. Listen. I just a little time out there. A little sightseeing and I'm back. That's all. Okay? I'm just tired of this house. So I'm not sightseeing enough. Uh, right? Okay. I didn't say that. Um, baby. What if, I'm just thinking, what if I die before you come back? Hey, come on. Can you see a thing like that, babe? You know what? I'm done. I'm staying back home. I'm not going anywhere again. Good. Good. Hmm? So let's go inside. Oh. So what do you have for me? Nothing. Oh, everything. Maybe nothing. Everything. I don't know. What do you mean nothing, babe? I said everything. What do you mean nothing? Come back here. You come with me. Alright. <laughs> I don't know, but there's something about this here. Well, Is it think, natural? I think it's okay. You know, some come, sure. some, yeah, some are in that color. Right. Sometimes so I used to wonder. <laughs> some are white and others are like, you know, golden yellow. Yeah. Sort of. I feel the, the white one tastes better. Who <laughs> <laughs> <It> says? <laughs> says me. No. That's not true. That's a very wrong analysis. <laughs> All eggs taste the same. Yeah, I know that. Oh. You're not adding pepper. I will. Is this okay now? Yeah, it is. Okay. So, I'll just add pepper. <laughs> Are you scared? Just enough. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> just trying to be careful. Careful with the salt, salt. So that's the one you should be careful with. Okay. Ha. No grand salt. I'll take permission before I put it in. Maybe that's too small. I don't know that's too small. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh that's a little too much. Okay, I'm just reducing. This. Okay, that's fine. There you that's go. Fine. Are you expecting someone? Not really. Uh. Now let me let me. No, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. I'll, I'll handle that, okay? Okay then. I'll be right back. Okay. I've been looking everywhere for you, Charles. For what? Why? Won't you let me in? Benita, state your reason for this visit. And leave immediately, please. Just why should I leave? Why, 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 why can't I go in? I mean, you're a single man, oh. Benita, you cannot be here, all right? So tell me why you're here and leave immediately, now! Well, Charles, I have come to stay. All right, now. Stop me. Benita, 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 can you stop? Hard. But anyways, I like plantain. Either is boiled or roasted. Oh. What could that be?
You're not supposed to be here. Any what? Benita, Benita, you have to leave now. I am not leaving nowhere. You have to leave my I house have come to now. Stay. I have come to stay. Stay where? What the hell are you talking about, Benita? You have to leave now. Charles, I... Benita! Hi! It's Nika! Hi! 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 You abandoned us. Why didn't we even hear from you? I mean, through our sick periods, you didn't even call in to check up on us. What happened? What did you do? Uh, you were sick? Are you serious? Tell she didn't even tell me. I mean, everybody in your family called in except you. You are the only family member who didn't call. Stop. I am not family. So how am I supposed to know? <laughs> how do you mean you're not family? Of course, you are family. Aren't you Charles's younger cousin? I mean, that's family enough. <laughs> cousin? That should be you. Come on, that's you. I mean, he told me you are his cousin. That's you, not me. <laughs> what are you talking about? Benita, come on. Come on, this is a joke, right? Why are you, what are you, what are you up to? I mean, talk to me. This is some sort of prank. Because you know me, you know who I am. I am Chica, his girlfriend. Sorry, I mean to say his fiancée. I mean, it's of, it's, it's of public knowledge. What are you saying? I am his girlfriend. Benita, you are the <laughs> Benita, can you stop this drama and leave my house? What drama? Can you stop Chica, all can this you just stop it? Your cousin should know I am your girlfriend. I am your girlfriend, so let her know. What, what is this? Benita, stop it. Come, just come on, stop it, okay? I mean, everyone knows that I am his girlfriend and I know that you are his cousin. So what a... Chica, okay. stop. I am not joking. I mean, I am pregnant for him. I'm not joking. <laughs> oh my God, just... You just confirmed it, Benita. Come on, this is a joke. Come, give me a hug. I'm happy you're pregnant. I mean, yeah, it's good news, but I mean, certainly not for your cousin. Come on, sit down. Enough of this, please, guys. Enough. <laughs> Does it look like I'm joking? I said I am pregnant for him. Chica, I am not joking. I am his girlfriend and this is his. Benita. Are you telling me that? Charles, yes, it's yours. Hold on a minute. Hold on. Charles. Did you, did you just ask her if the pregnancy is truly yours? So it means there's a possibility that <laughs> she's pregnant for you? I mean, uh, no, th this is a joke. This is not even April 1st, so I don't know what this is about. I mean, of course, it's, it has to be a joke. So just tell me it's a joke. <clears throat> Charles? No, no, this is a joke. So you tell me it's a joke. Say it. I want to hear it from you. It's a joke, right? Charles? Charles? Fucking talk to me. This is a joke. to calm down baby don't you dare ask me to calm down how dare you do you want me to calm down oh my god charles how, how dare you make a joke out of me how dare you make a mess of the love i have for you goodness how can you even do this to me Oh my God! I I gave my kidney to a cheating bastard, and to think you told me Benita is your sister, but yes, she's someone you're sleeping with. I didn't know how to bring myself to tell you the truth. I, I didn't know how to do that. And you told her that I am your sister. That I, Chica, that I'm your sister. Babe, listen. It is true I told you Benita was my sister. 
but she knows you're my woman. I swear to God, I don't know why she's doing this. I will never introduce you to anyone as my sister. Not even Benita. Never. Goodness. Benita is pregnant. Benita is pregnant for you. It means only one thing, that you go about town sleeping with people without using condom. And that is the result. Babe, it was just once. Once? Yes, and I used protection. I think it broke. Charles! I'm sorry. Charles! Babe. When did this happen? When did this happen? Damn it! Talk to me! When? I'm trying to I'm trying to put the figures together, okay? I I think it's Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at you. Charles, look at you. You could not even explain yourself to me. I'm trying to. Alright, I'm I can't no, fix take when I'm at you. No, look at you! You can't even defend yourself. I loved you. I loved you. I sacrificed for you. And this is how you pay me babe, back. Babe, Don't touch me. Babe. Don't you dare come close to me. Don't you dare. You don't deserve me. You do not deserve me. What's the meaning of this? Just come on, take it easy. I, I, I'm pregnant. I don't care. I don't fucking care about this shit. What's the meaning of this? Just please, please. If you don't want me and the baby, I, 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 I can leave. Just get out. I said, it's okay, get it's okay, it's out. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I'll leave. Wait. Are you sure? Very sure. Very, very sure. I'm responsible for that child you carry. Charles, you know I know no other man. You know, you know it's, just, it's just you. It's your pregnancy. What is it? 
I am finished. You go for bed. You are not finished. Eh? Talk to us now, my daughter, please. Talk to us. Chica, what is it? What eh? is the problem? Talk. Stop. Say something now. Eh? You're giving us BP here. Talk to us. Let's know what the problem is and how to tackle it. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I disappointed you. Vera, I'm sorry I failed you. I failed all of you. I'm so sorry. You, you disappointed me. <laughs> how? I... I... Sister, talk now. Uh -uh, talk. I, I had the surgery. Hey! What? Chica! Chica! Chica, how can you do such a thing? How? Hey! Chica, how can you give your, your kidney to a man who is not your husband? Let's even say it's your husband. Why would you just give out your kidney like that? Sister, I thought Mama told you not to do it. Why did you do it? I thought I was in love. Love? You thought you were what? Chica! Chica, how could you? Hey! Chica, you have finished me. Chica, you have killed me. What am I going to do? What do you want me to do? Hey! Hey! Uh, hey! Chica! Chica! Hey! No, this is not true at all! Chica, it's not true! How could you do this to me? What am I going to do? How will I explain this to my husband? How? Mama, <laughs> Mama, Mama, please, I beg you, don't tell Papa anything. Please, I'm begging you. I'm sorry. That's not even the problem. After, after giving him my kidney, I now realize that he's important. What? <laughs> important. Mama, stop. Mama, stop. Come here, Wolf. Sit down, sit down. It's okay. Hey! Mama, stop. I, 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 I'm sorry. I, 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 That's not the problem. I, 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 I didn't hear you. You said that's not what. You mean there is more. Well, I'm listening. Talk. I will calm down now. I'm, I'm, I'm calm. She said you should talk. I'm calm. Before. Before the surgery. Charles was cheating on me uh -huh. with a girl. <laughs> okay. A girl called Benita. He told me Benita was his cousin. I didn't know they were dating. So Benita got pregnant for him before he became impotent. Ah! <laughs> and <laughs> Benita now lives with us. <laughs> Who is Benita? Benita lives in our house, pregnant, pregnant for Charles. Ah! Hey! Ha! 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 Chica! Charles had to accept her because he's now impotent, remember? Oh! You're even defending him! Because? He can't have a child anymore, so, so we let Benita in, into our house. But now I'm going through hell. I'm going through a lot in that house. My, I don't know what to do. Chica, wait, wait, wait. Sister, Verónica, you are you are okay? I I I know this is too much for one person. But Sister Chica, how could you do this? What are you thinking? I was, I was, I was not thinking straight. I was, I was, I was madly in love with him. Chica, what are you doing in that house? You're fighting for a man, a man who is important, 
Okay, let's assume you fight and you get this man. Are you going to get pregnant by this man? Is he going to get you pregnant? So what is the point, Chita? No, what is the point? Because this is pointless to me. No, no, it's pointless. Umba, sister, make one of you. The point is that my sister, by all means possible, you have to collect her kidney back. Please, my children, this is not the best time to fight. Let's see solutions. We need a solution to this problem because. I will kill myself. Mama. I will kill myself. Oh, I'm sorry. Chica. I will kill myself for you. I'm sorry. sorry for what? I'm sorry. sorry for what? Let me ask you something now. I'm sorry. So you, you did not just give this this stupid man your kidney. He cheated on you. Let's even address that part. How did he get her pregnant when he's impotent? Mm. Before the disease made him impotent, they were already dating, boy. He didn't know that. Oh, 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 I see. So while you were busy donating your kidney to Charles, Charles was busy donating his sperm to someone he feels is worthy of being the mother of his child, right? He didn't know. He, uh, he didn't what? He didn't know. Chica, you are Ha! Ah! Chica, you are the biggest fool alive. You are the biggest fool of all time. Mama, my own is that. This very problem is not in mathematics, so you not get solution. The only thing where they worry me now is how to go collect my sister kidney from Charles. If they say he's important, no problem. But my sister's kidney, he's, he's never going to live with it. Me, Amaka, I'll personally go and collect it. So, Mama. No. I have to go. Hmm? <sighs> Let me go back and continue with the begging. <sighs> but Veronica, why are you begging him? Why? For him to take me to court and wed me. Oh really, you're still about the court wedding thing? Like seriously, whatever for? I mean, why do you really need it? You are married. He loves you. You love him. That's all that matters. There's a marriage already. Do you really need to go to court? Chica, I don't understand you either. What are you talking about? I've been married to this man for nine good years. And there is no evidence to show it. Not even a certificate or a ring. Please. Please. My daughter. Mama. Please, don't let this be an issue between you and your husband. You have been asking for this for a very long time. Yet, he played deaf. So, let him be happy. Mama, I will not let him be. Happy. Mama, I will not happy. I will not let him be. What is all this? Mama, what are you people talking about? I'm the one wearing this shoe and I know where it's hitching me. Oh. My problem with this whole issue is... This guy is not even telling me, okay, this is why I don't want to do this. So let it slide. Chica, please, can you stop? My problem with everybody in this house is that we all know what is right. Mm. Yet, we refuse to do it. Okay, so what are you on about? I am talking to sister. You, what I am saying is this. If your husband refused to grant your request, threaten him with a divorce. Better still. Drug him and drag him to court. Amaka, are you huh? mad? Amaka. I, I, will you shut that thing you call a mouth? Amaka. Are you okay? Amaka, this conversation is too big for you. Eh? So, could you do this? Did that cannot me, Mari Higi? Shut your mouth, keep quiet. Everybody's screaming, Amaka, 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 Amaka. Mama, why are you telling me to meet you on? Are you not the same mama that has been telling me, Amaka, go and get married? Amaka, you need to get married. Now you are telling me I am not meant to put my mouth in this conversation. Mama, if I am old enough to get married, how come I am too young to be involved in this kind of conversation? How come? <sighs> Mama, my dear, please let me go before this girl aggravates my anger. It's okay. I don't want to do something I will regret. It's okay. The truth is that women no. will not have anything attached to their names. Are being referred to as gold diggers by their husbands. So go and look for what you do. 
so that you said you will have money. Amaka. Amaka, this is too harsh. Obu ni mari hige kui mechion ugi pichion ugi amaka. Amaka, when will you learn how to talk to your sister politely? When? How can I talk to her in a polite way? When she knows what to do and she has refused to do it. Mm. Moreover, these are my two sisters here. They hate to hear the truth. Huh? Mm -hmm. And sister, first mm. of all, when are you going back to your fiancé's house? Hello? Hmm. Amaka, I do not intend to go back to that house. I am not going back. Why? What do you mean why? Are you trying to tell me that you will remain in this house? Like, you will remain miserable in this house. Why that fiancé of yours, that useless man, gallivants about happily, enjoys his life? But seriously, what am I supposed to do? I am not going to go about fighting for what is not fighting for me. Like, seriously, come to think of it, what am I even fighting for? You are kidding me. Veronica, you had me well. Eh? You had me well. Why are you sweating over this? I said no, and my no is no. Veronica, can you stop shouting? Really, why are you treating me like this? Please, I'm begging you. Did I do anything wrong? Did I do any wrong to you? Please. Veronica, stop playing this busy card here. Huh? I provide for the family. And make sure that you and the kids are comfortable. So what else do you want? Ken, I want a court wedding. I want a court wedding. It's that too much to ask. I'm asking for it because we did not even have a proper traditional wedding. Not to talk of a white wedding. All you did was pay my bread price and that was it. Am I not good enough? Don't I deserve to be wedded? I am glad you came out playing. So you want my money, right? Ken, what are you talking about? Oh, stop playing that dumb with me here. You want to kill me and have access to my money? Of course, I know. I know your plans. Ken! I said my wife is what out on me calling me disgusting. When did she learn to disrespect you? Exactly what I want to find out. The woman I married with my own hard earned money. Okay, please calm down. Ken, I need you to calm down. What exactly transpired? Veronica wants a court wedding, and I said no, as the man of the house. I thought you guys were done and over with the issue of court wedding. Exactly. I am. But she is not. Then you give her what she wants. You see, as long as it's marriage, a woman would always get what she wants. Are you the one talking? Or something talking to you? Not because you do not get the point. If anything happens, say, in the case of divorce, Veronica will share my properties with me. <laughs> Why do my gender always think and talk about property sharing each time the issue of court wedding arises? Say, man, you are still a bachelor. You are not married. Therefore, you won't understand what I am talking about. I bought these properties with my money, my hard-earned money. And in the name of divorce, Veronica will share these properties with me. Who said you are getting a divorce? You don't know these women. As soon as I give her court marriage right now, she starts singing here and now, divorce here, divorce there and all. No, I am not ready to hear that boy. I'm not ready. Uh, okay. Um, Ken, go, just God forbid. What if you die? What happens to your kids? Are you 
praying for me to die? No, I, I'm, it's, it's, it's not prayers, but I'm just saying, what if my friend Ken drops dead today? What happens to your kids, their education, their welfare? Their... Do you care at all? Do you think and care about that? I am done with this conversation. I don't know how any time I bring my problem to you always on the side of my wife. Why can't you take side with me? Really? I am done. I, am, I don't want to talk about it again. Please, end it there. You are my friend, so I expected you to take side with me. Why always on the side of my wife? Ready. I'm not dying today. And what is that supposed to mean? It means I don't want to eat your poisoned food. Ken, Ken, can you stop? Can you stop saying all this nonsense? What, what's that? What's that for? Veronica, do you think I don't know your plan? Don't answer me. Why will a comfortable married woman be seeking for a court wedding? Answer me. What does it stand to do in a family? Does it resolve conflict in marriage? Or does it give a woman an edge to share her husband's property? In the case of divorce. Now I get it. Can now I see it. So, you think this is about property? No, 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 Ken. So, this whole thing to you is about sharing of properties. Is that what you think? Veronica. Veronica. If it's not about property, then what is it all about? Is it too hard for me to ask? Is it too hard for me to ask you? Nine good years of marriage, no white wedding at all. Nine good years of marriage, no wedding. Babes, won't you eat your breakfast? Did I discuss anything about breakfast with you? Madam, keep your food. I am not hungry. I haven't eaten my food for two days now. Mama, what should I do? What do I do? Because I don't know what to do at this point.
pamper his ego. Yes, mama, that's what you're talking about. I should apologize. Apologize for what? Mama, I'm talking about... Mama, you're talking about me pampering a man's ego. How about how I feel? Do you even care about that? Okay. I've heard you, Mama. I'll try. Mama, I'll try. And if I try, it doesn't work. I don't know what else to do. Because I don't understand the kind of frustration I'm going through in this marriage. Is this how marriage is? No problem, Mama. I've heard you. I've heard you. I'll try. I'll, 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 I'll apologize. Although I don't know what I'm apologizing for, but I'll apologize. No problem. I'll call you later. I don't like the way you're crying, no. I don't like it. Eh? As far as I am concerned, crying will not solve anything. What would you have me do? What do you want me to do? What am I supposed to do? I don't know. Two things are involved, sister. It's either you take your mom back, or you take your kid back. You must decide to do one. I'm like, I don't understand you. you. You make it look as if taking back my kidney is an option. How is that, that even an option? That is because you have not made it an option. Charles needs to know. Needs to know what? That you can decide to take your kidney back whenever you so wish. <sighs> Amaka. I know that. Charles loves me. I know. I know he's not in love with Benita. I can feel it. I can see it in his eyes. I, 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 I know when a man is in love with a woman, you will know, you can tell. He's only with Benita for a reason and that is the baby. I do not think there's any other reason Charles would want to be with Benita over me. Certainly not. But I, I also understand. I understand. I, I know where he's coming from. Any man in his shoes probably do the same or even worse. I mean, come to think of it, that is his only chance of having a child. That is why he's keeping her. Eh? Wonder shall never end. Wow. So, you are still defending him. Wait, sister, you are crying. Like, you are bitter because of this man. And you're still defending him. That is his only reason. That is his only chance. How? I don't understand though. Like, I am wondering why two beautiful ladies will be fighting over a man who is impotent. Whereas there are too many fertile men hovering all over the world. Amaka, oh, don't go there. Do not. <laughs> Do not speak about my child in that manner. I'm not going to let you do that. Okay? Do not. Enough. Enough. <laughs> you do not have any right to talk to him in that manner. Talk about him in this tone. Don't you ever, please, don't try it again. Wow. Don't try it again, no, because I'm just sitting here listening to you. You're not running your mouth, insulting him. Just, do not talk about my fiancé like that again. I have told you. I will not repeat it again. Sister. That man has been breaking your heart. And you're telling me, you're, you're warning me. Well, I will not stop you. And if you don't want us to get involved, if you don't want this family to intervene, why come to us with your problem? 
mind your business. Of course I will. I will. But you came here. You came crying and you're still crying. If you never told us a thing, sister, how are we going to know? We'll be minding our business, so. But because you brought your problems here, that is why we are here. Oh. If you don't want us to intervene, sister, please, next time, keep your sympathy story to yourself. Because me, I will not sit and be watching you cry, yet you expect me to say nothing. Baby, please. My love, please. If I've offended you in any way, please forgive me. I'm sorry. Please. Baby. If you have offended me, so you don't think you have offended me, but indirectly asking me to share my properties with you, Baby, that is that not an offense? Baby, that is not what I mean. That's not what I'm trying to say. Oh, you're not calling me a liar. Me, Ken, lying against you. Is that what you mean? Ken, what is your problem? No, exactly what is your problem? What is the color of your problem? I'm here kneeling down, begging you for what I don't even know what I did wrong. Really, what did I do? No, go to think of it. What did I do wrong by asking you to wed me in the court of law? You did not do white wedding. You did not even do a proper traditional wedding. Then I'm begging you to do the easy one, which is just going to the court, just me and you and few other witnesses, and, and, and do a court wedding. You're yes, telling me nonsense. If not that my mother asked me to apologize, would that be yes? Needing an apologize for nonsense, nonsense I know nothing about. I knew it. I said it. I know this apology is not an ordinary apology. Uh, please, knew whatever you like. Knew it, know it. Whatever you like, no. What is it? What is it, Ken? What is it? Huh? I'm tired of this madness. Oh. I am tired of this madness because I'm trying everything possible to fix this family, to fix this marriage, but all you do is scatter it. I'm trying to make this things easy, but you're making it difficult. Huh? Now listen, since you enjoy eating outside, it's okay. Ken, you can eat as much as you want outside. I don't care anymore. But what I will no longer do in this house is prepare meal for you since you don't want to eat. Since you do not want to eat my food, Ken, no problem. Suit yourself. Hey, come here. Don't you dare. Don't try that. As long as you live under my roof, as long as I'm still your husband, as long as I married you and you're living with me, don't you try. Don't walk out of me when I'm still talking to you. Simon, I am tired. I am tired of this thing called marriage. Timan, let me ask you. Is marriage a cause of a blessing? Depending which of it you want. If you want peace, give her what she wants. Cut warning. Never. Never. Timan, i rather divorce her. I mean, i rather send her back to her people than wedding her in the court. Never. Ken, now let's talk about your properties. You are not one very rich guy. Why are you making it look like your wife is a thief? Timon, any woman agitating for a court wedding without having anything in her name is a thief. <laughs> Wait a minute. Are you trying to tell me that my properties are not enough for me to decline a court wedding or what? Why do you like it? <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Okay, okay, now, now, okay. A house. 
four plots of land. Four oh, plots of land. And one car. Oh, come on. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's funny. I know of wealthy men who go into court wedding. They do court wedding without fear of anything. And here you are making a mountain out of nothing. For four plots. <laughs> are you mocking me or what? Hmm? <laughs> no, I don't get it. Are you mocking me? <laughs> no, no, no. No, no, no. Okay, now that's my problem with you. You take everything into a fight. I wonder how your wife cope with you. Enough. Timan, enough of this nonsense. Enough! Okay. <laughs> I guess you for free. Let me quickly tidy something up for you. I know you must be very hungry. <laughs> Timan, are you insulting me or what? Is it because I come to your house to eat once in a while? You are insulting me. Ken, bring down your ego. If I get angry, I will make the food. You know you don't eat out. You are either eating in my house or in yours. And for some time now, you have not been eating at home. Except you are ready to go home and beg, madam. sleeping why I am here dying of hunger God don't let me die before day breaks Since when did you start eating breakfast? Are you 
you talking back at me? Ken, I make food in this house, you don't eat it. It's either I trash it or I give it to the gate man. So what's the point of me making breakfast when you will not eat it? Why stress myself? Veronica, this is my house. Whether I eat the food or not, it's none of your business. As long as I have not stopped providing for this house, you don't have the right or whatsoever not to cook for me, Veronica. Even when you're not going to eat it, Ken? Even when I am not going to eat it, Veronica, it is my money and not your money. Hold on, hold on, Ken. Let me get something straight. You're saying I have to make food even when I know I am going to trash it at the end of the day? Of course, you have to make food. Oh, really? Then you need to get a chef. Are you? Did you just say that? Ken, you heard me. Get a chef and stop stressing me. Veronica! Stop! Stop tempting me, Veronica! Stop! Stop! I will lose it one day! Girl, the day you will raise those hands and lie them on me! You will be buried! your mother. Mama, I'm tired. Go for bed. I'm tired. You can never be tired. I have told you how to follow your husband. Because he is a hot-tempered person. Huh? Mama, I've applied everything. Everything in the book. Yet, none worked. Mama, at this point, it's as if my husband despises me. It's, it's as if I irritate him. Mama, to the extent, Ken raised his hand to hit me. Huh? Me, Veronica. Mama, please, I'm, I'm, I've tried. Mm -mm, I've tried. Um, Vero, have you stopped talking about the court wedding? Mama, I have stopped. I have stopped. I've even begged him. I've been begging him since. I know I have no reason to beg Ken, but I've been the one begging. Yet not, nothing is working. I want you to listen to me. Marriage is endurance. You... Mama, please, 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 please. I am tired of hearing endurance. Mama, do you think I've not been enduring? No, do you think I have not been enduring? For a good nine years, Mama, I've been enduring. Like, if I list out things that I've, 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 I had to endure in this marriage, I'm sure you did not pass through that in Papa's hands. Eh? Is it till I die before you people will see how much I've endured? I married a very difficult man. I don't understand if this is how marriage is. I don't want again, no. Makamam can came see ditch. I don't know how my own became so different. Eh? Sister, did you say different? Your own is not though. As a matter of fact, Sister Chica left here this morning crying. Mama, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Your own case. Your own case they left for where Sister did. But my problem with you is that you have solution to your wahala, but I refuse to use it. Maka, what are you talking about? Sister, get a job. Eh? Eh, Mama. Get a job. The moment you get something doing and begin to contribute to the family, believe me, your problems will be solved. I don't blame you. You're a child. 
it's easier for you to open your mouth and say, get a job, get a job. If I get a job, Amaka, who will take care of my children? No, who will take care of my home? Do you think I just stay at home? I'm not doing anything. And that is the problem, exactly the wala. Shebi, if you get a job now, they will pay you. If they pay you salary, sister, get a nanny, get a chef, buy washing machine, get a laundry personnel, pay them from there. Until you begin to do these things, your husband will never value your efforts. Kokwamia, tell your husband that you want to switch role. Mm, tell him that you want to now work and make money while he stays at home and takes care of the family. Lolu. Hey! Special advisor. Oh, you fuki hero, you get away. A paper, 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 a because this is all about who brings what to the table. Mama, can see this every slightest opportunity to tell me how much he provides for the home? Because he provides for the home, I have to obey every law from his mouth. Mama, the other day I was sick. Very, very sick, Mama. I couldn't move. I begged my husband to help me prepare food. So that him and the children will eat. It's not as if I wanted to eat. Do you know what this man told me? That I have to go and do my work as the wife. That he's the one providing for the house. Mama, if I had a job and then I was contributing money into the family, I'm sure this would not have happened. For the first time, Mamaka actually has a point. The truth, sister, is that you're married to a drama king. And to balance this equation, you have to become a drama queen. Adam, why? Why, Oma? Please. You have to respect him. He is your husband. He should be the head of the family. Don't mind this Amaka and her evil, evil advice. Eh? Biko. Biko. Sister, the truth is that no man will ever treat me like that. You see the way they treat you and Sister Chica. In fact, the woman will go bond the man we go treat me like that. They never bond that woman. Good. You will see it now. Go and marry. Mm -hmm. Go and get a man first. Let's see how you will control and handle him and take over him. That shouldn't bother you. Mama, it should not bother you at all because I will do it. And you will see it happen. Any man that will marry me should be ready to worship me. Why do you have please don't listen to her. Chica, I am sorry. I am sorry about the way things turned out. I mean, if Charles was really truthful to us, things wouldn't have been this bad. Wouldn't have happened this way. Um, you see, Benita, I do not have anything against anyone trying to be smart or play smart. At the same time, I am allergic to people looking at me straight in my eyes and trying to make a fool out of me. I'm a grown up woman. I know when someone is trying to play with my intelligence. Benita, you knew. You knew that I and Charles are planning to get married. No, no. <laughs> Think about it. You knew that Charles and I are in a relationship that was leading somewhere positive. What did you do? You you know, came into the picture, played a perfect script 
of being his little cousin. Slept with him, with my man, and even got pregnant for him. Okay, I would like to ask you a question, Benita. What are you trying to achieve with all of this? Chica, what is this? I just told you that he said to me that you are his cousin. Yes. <laughs> you see, what is, what is even funny is the fact that you're trying to import some senseless lies into this. I mean, this is bad enough. This is shameful enough. Why bring your lies into it? You knew. Okay. You knew. Come on, Benita. You knew. Take responsibility. You knew. Oh, so he, he told you what he told you. And you believed him? I mean, you're making me a liar. <laughs> okay, okay, fine, fine. Let, let. If you are saying, or you're feeling that Charles is in love with you, or he loves you, whatever, fine. But, but, but why did he come to me? Why did he come to go down with me, telling me that you are his cousin? I mean, don't you think that is the height of the set? Mm. Mm. Uh, yeah, that's true. I think I agree with you on this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. that, this simply means that Charles, Charles is really deceitful. Simple. I can see that. But Benita, please let me ask you a question. Knowing all of this, you know, how deceitful Charles has been. What are you still doing here? <laughs> what, what, what are you saying? Of course, I, I, I am pregnant. I'm carrying his child. I mean, something you can never have a chance to do. And he has one of my kidneys, darling. Something he's going to carry for the rest of his life. You know what that means? It means that if I, Chica, dare to take back my kidney, your child is going to be fatherless. So if I were you, <laughs> I'll be very smart. Uh, but is, that, is, that, is that all you can offer? Chica, don't forget that I've got kidneys too. Yes. Benita, I doubt if your kidney is ever going to be a match. Mm. You know, you're very brave. I give it to you. Thank you. You're very strong and daft at the same time. Yeah, I, I cannot, cannot do what you've done. I cannot. Because some sacrifices actually meant for certain people. Chica, donating my kidney is certainly not my thing. Don't you dare touch me. Listen, babe. I know you are mad at me. I mean, very mad at me. But yes. It you have every reason to be mad at me right now. But what will you have me do? I'm only human.
You know, I thought we would never have a child of our own. Even if we thought of adopting one, the child will never carry our blood. But then, Benita came like an answered prayer. Answered prayer. Charles! So, Benita is your own definition of an answered prayer. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Hey, come oh, on. I see. I why, see. why can't you understand me? Why can't you reason from my point of view? Listen, I, I know I made, I made a mistake. Yes, I did. But right now I think this is a blessing and disguise. God has his own way of doing things and this is one of them. Somebody wake me up. Babe, I know I messed up. Yes, I messed up big time. But come on. We need to move on, darling. We need to move on. Look at the brighter side. I can't believe this. This is unbelievable. Move on. Really? Really? Charles? Babe. Oh, really? Charles? Given the same situation, me pregnant with another man's child while carrying your kidney, that's if you'll ever give me a kidney. Will you move on just like that? Maybe you're not dead. What is going on? I, I heard voices. So I, I just came to, to separate the fight though. Please. I do not want anybody to shed any blood in my house. I don't want it. I don't, I don't like blood. Benita. Yes. Nobody was fighting. Really? But I have voices. Benita. Get out. Get out of my room. Sorry? Get out? Sorry, is he married to you? What right do you have to ask me to leave this house? What right do you have? Benita, please leave. Because why are you asking me to leave? You, you know I'm pregnant, I'm carrying your child. I, I, I don't need to sleep alone. So I, I, I... Benita! Benita, get the hell out of this room now! Benita, get out of my room Benita, this minute! Benita, you have to leave. I'm not going anywhere. Benita, get out. I am pregnant though. I don't need to stay. No. Be Be Benita, I understand the fact that you're pregnant. But when she says leave, you have to leave now! Ben, baby. Benita, leave. Benita, leave now. <laughs> leave. Leave. Out. Now. Get out. Leave, 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 leave My now. Wait, 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 where are your sleepers? Get out. Just go. Go. Goodness. Goodness. Somebody wake me up. Babe. Somebody Babe. wake me up. Babe. I'm sorry. Okay? I didn't sign up for this. I know. I know, babe. All I want from her is the child. All we want is the child. Okay? Listen to me. As soon as she gives birth, I will take the child from her and discard her. I promise you, I don't want anything else. 
opportunity to help me in this. I can't do this on my own. Please, babe. Please, I beg you. Please, babe. Tell you officially, I'm going in there to pack my things and leave. Why? Why? Because you asked me to leave the house. I asked you to leave our room, not the house. Just what is the difference? I ask you, what is the difference? You cannot give me things. Then allow me to go out there and have it. Benita, I will not let you carry my child out there to have an affair with another man. No, I will not do that. Do I sense jealousy here? No, 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 it's not jealousy. It's rather disgusting. Alright? Why the rush? You are almost due. Why don't you just wait until you put to bed? Then you can do whatever you want. Sorry, touch your body. I cannot wait. I need it. I need it. My body needs it. So if you will not give it to me, let me go and have it. Benita, I will not. I cannot give you Yeah, let me go! Let me go! Alright, fine, fine, fine. I'll get you toys. Whatever you want. Whatever size you want, I'll get them for you. Okay? Shut yourself out. What did you just say now? I said I will get you toys! What about you? What is wrong with you? I am unavailable! What is wrong with other men outside? Let me go and have it if you cannot give it to me! Not with my child! Yeah, I see. So because of how you refuse to touch you, a woman that is pregnant for you? Hey, 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 listen. Mind the way you talk to her. She's my fiance. My fiance! Who am I? A vessel to carry your child? What is the meaning of this? I mean, what do you intend to achieve with all of this? What is Chica? My problem is I need sex. And Charles has refused to give me sex. So you should allow me to go and, and have it out there. So I... Okay. Uh, uh, what you are invariably trying to say is that my fiancé right here should have sex with you under my nose, in my own house, under my roof. What changed? I ask you, what changed? Have you been doing it? So what changed? Yeah, you're, you're I guess you've been doing it. So what is it? What kind of accusation is that? I, 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 are you mad? Charles? Babe, don't. What, what is Charles? What is Charles? I did you tell me? What is that? What do you want to do? Do so you want to come and beat me? No, Charles, I'm not to come and beat me. Come and beat the pregnant woman. I did, do I blame you? Have you been pregnant before? Do you understand my predicament? What is this? Don't fall for this. You should fall for it. So I'm going to have it on my living. Benita. What? Benita. What? How many times did I call you? If you must remain in this house, you must. I repeat, you must respect Chica. Respect you? Who is Chica again? No, I ask you, who is Chica again? Kate not done alright? Excuse me. Don't. I shouldn't listen to her. 
Okay, I should listen to you, right? I, I should listen to you. Okay, okay, let me listen to you. Charles, why are you stopping her from going out there to meet other men? Why? Is she your wife? Babe, I can't believe you're asking me this question. Benita is pregnant. She's carrying my child. And so what? Our child. And you expect me to allow her to go out with our child to meet other men? How? So what about it? No, 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 no. So what about it? So what? Don't you talk to me. What? Are you kidding me? <sighs> Babe. I know this is a very hard pill to swallow, but look at me. I need you to walk this work with me. Supposing I want to walk this path with you, what if the road gets dark and lonely? No matter how dark and lonely it gets. I'll need you there. Because you're my strength. <sighs> Listen, darling. I'm late for work. I need you to be in your best behavior. Okay? Stay off her path. She's bad news. Promise me. I trust you. Come here. I'll see you when I get back. Okay? Smile for daddy. <laughs> Now she should stay off my path. Why he didn't tell you not to look for me? Benita playing music this high is looking for my trouble already. Yes. Then close your ears. If you don't like this music, close your ears. My child wants to dance. He needs music and you cannot stop him. Your child? Yes. Benita, the last time I checked you're still in your first trimester. What child are you talking about? This child knows nothing about dances and music. What are you saying? Avoid me. Avoid me. I am trying to avoid you. Also try to avoid me. Avoid me. Benita, I'm avoiding you, but do not play music this loud in this house. Keep it low. Or better still, forget about it. If you can't keep it low, leave it. Yes. Simple. You might think I'm your child, right? Just keep it low. Or better still, forget about playing this music. Okay? Keep it low. And that's it. <laughs> Hello? What? Stop it. Put it 
off. What is wrong with you? Can't I, 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 I think that's it. Chica. Are you okay? Chica. 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 What is your problem? What, 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 what is it? What, what is it? I just said my child wants to dance. Benita. Mm -hmm. Benita. Yes. Benita, do not push me. Benita, if you push me, you will not like me. What would you do? You will not like the what reaction. Would what would you do? Benita, I'm warning you. Do not push your luck. Copy. Do not push your luck. When I say my wife is planning to kill me, you have to believe me. Look, my life is in danger. She wants to kill me. I am not safe any longer. Believe me, I am your friend. I can't lie to you. No, okay, okay, okay. My guy, just calm down. Calm down. I know your wife, Veronica, cannot plan to kill you. Tima, listen. She looked at me, eyeball to eyeball, face to face. She said it, she said she would kill me. And this time around, believe me, she meant it. Okay. What did you do? It doesn't matter what I did. She wants to kill me. That should be the bone of contention here. Ken, thank God you are alive. She has not killed you or she couldn't kill you. But let's get to the bottom. What prompted her threat, her desire, her wish to kill you? What happened? Uh, yeah. no, she, 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 she got me angry. Then I, I raised my hands to, to, to hit her. But, well, trust me, I didn't touch her. I didn't hit her. Maybe that's why you're still alive. Tima, on whose side are you? Truth. I'm on the side of truth. A anyway, are you hungry? Don't change the topic here. Ken, you know if we continue this conversation, there will be no food for you. You want to insult me again because I eat in your house, right? That's my problem with you. I think I'm able to aid in your problems. Yes! Every time you come here, I give you food. Am I the one to give you food? Your wife should be serving you food. And I just told you that my wife has stopped preparing my meals. And that's because you stopped eating her food. Go back and beg your wife. Me? Ken? To go back and beg my wife? Never. I can! I will never, ever do that. And listen, listen real good. Today will be the last day that I can we eat in your house again. There we go again. Kenneth Unjoku. Bring your pride down. Bring it down! Only this one thing I'm begging you 
Rice, soup, just make something. What is it? She tore my book. Ada, why did you tear his book? It was a mistake and I, and I apologized to him. Apology won't you tore my book. If apology can, they keep apologizing. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Where is that attitude coming from? What did I tell you about accepting apologies? Nothing is done on purpose. Ada, come here. Say sorry to your brother. Okay, I'm sorry, I won't do it again. You'll not do it again. You'll not do it again. Hey, hey. mister. Mm -mm. Where is that behavior coming from? Where is that coming from? Since when? Shut Will you shut up? Your mom is talking. What did I tell you about accepting apologies from people? And after you've accepted the apology, what do you do? You have the best. I can't hear you. Hope the best. Hello, mister. I cannot hear you. Can you speak up? Hope the best thing. Good boy. Now go and hug your sister. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Mother Abuchi, you're not hugging your sister with that face. Put a smile on it. That's not the kind of smile I'm waiting for. Smile. 32. Open it. Good boy. And clean those tears. Hug her well. <laughs> What is it? Ah! Honey! No, no, don't come down. Don't come close. This place is sleeper. Please, you will fall. But dad, are you okay? Oh, uh, yes. <laughs> I'm okay. Yeah, I'm okay. But I didn't want cooking for us today. Oh, uh, yes, I... <laughs> hey, sweeties. Daddy asked me to stop by today while he makes the food. He wow. wants to surprise you all. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what? Isn't that honey? Uh, yes, yeah, I'm actually making food for, for us to eat. And I see you're doing a great job. Can you imagine Daddy had to remove his shirt because he's sweating? <laughs> Dad, what are we having? Oh, jollof rice. Wow. <laughs> but Dad, where are the meat on the floor? Ah, uh, mm. <laughs> too uh, many questions. Uh, Okay, let's leave Daddy to continue with what he's doing. We cannot wait to eat Daddy's food. Yeah, Can we cl clap for Daddy? Clap for Daddy. Doing a great job. You see, I told you, men do cook. You see, Daddy's cooking. Let's go. <laughs> What is the problem? Dear, the kids just come into the kitchen now. Wait, they are more. And they said they are going to eat the food. What? Uh, the man, yes, I. I'll be on the phone, please. Keep guiding me on what next to do. Yeah? I don't want to cook nonsense. Yes. From look of things, all of us are going to eat the food together. All right. 
Thank you. Jesus! Is it that bad? Mm -mm. It's not bad. It is horrible. Terrible. Beautiful. Like, are you enjoying it? Of course, this was nice. Enjoy it. It's easy. It's easy. It's it, it, it. Enjoy it. Do you think it's easy to cook? Yeah? Yeah? Why is my mom not cook in the first place? Enjoy it. Eat. No good anything. Eat. I rather start than to eat this food. I'm not eating you. It's kind of nonsense. Come here, come here, eat this thing, oh. I'm not eating everything. Enjoy this food. I'd rather starve or die than eat it. This is not food. This is not food. It's okay, it's okay. Ah. It's okay. Ah. I'll fix something else for you, okay? Better, oh. I'm better, oh. Ah. Come on. Can I be married yet, living like someone that is single? I need my wife so badly this night. But I don't think I can have her. I don't know what her reaction will be. Oh, Ken. Ken, why not respect yourself? Respect yourself and prevent embarrassment. No. No. She's my wife. I need her. And I must have her.
to them are you going to work? Work. Which work? Well, I guess the table has turned. You get to stay at home while I get to go to work. What are you talking about? Remember to clean the house, wash the dishes, clean up the kids, get them ready for school, wash their clothes, my clothes, your clothes, and um, what again, what again, what again, sweep the house, and um, darling, most importantly, make sure you bring back the cakes from school on time, else you'll pay for coming late. Um, have a great day. Bye. Veronica left this job for me. What kind of a woman is this? That we first were late. I... I am sorry, honey. I'm almost done. Dad, you can carry a lunch bag. Do you go to school with food? Yes, Dad. Oh, Alright, in that case, then let me take you to school, then I'll come back and prepare your lunch, okay? Uh, no, Dad. Mom, do Mom doesn't do that. We go to school with our food, so... Uh, the, the truth is, we are late, okay? So I will take you to school, then come back home, prepare your lunch, and bring it to school for you, okay? Okay, Dad. All right, darling, let's go. All right, let's go. Uh, get your bag. Get your bag, let's go. Fast. Fast. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Sleeping. Eh? 
Are you done with everything you're supposed to do? Ken, I'm asking you. I hope you prepared dinner even. Hello, did you prepare dinner? Eric, are you mad? Eh? Are you mad? What do you mean am I mad? Ken, are you, are, are, are you mad? No, you are you mad? I, I, I suffer every day. I go out to work to bring the money into this house for food and everything. But you, you, just, just to take care of the house chores, you cannot. What do you even do? No, 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 no. Ken, what do you bring to the table? What exactly do you do other than take care of the children? Come to think of it, talk of the children. Where are my kids? Why are they not running around here? Hold on, hold on, Ken. Ken, please. I hope you went to pick my children up from school, like I said. Oh, Veronica, you should have done that on your way back now, eh? Ken, are you saying my kids are seen in school? Hey! Ken, you did not pick my kids from school! Are you mad? You're stupid! You're, you're, you're stupid, Danny! Get out! 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 Veronica! 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 Oh, it's a dream. Honey, what is it? Uh, Baby, what is it? I, I'm fine. Uh, what do you mean you're not you're fine? You you were calling Veronica, don't hit me. What is it? It was just a slip of tongue. Baby. Baby, you know you can tell me anything. What is it? I said I am fine, I'm fine! Ah! I'm fine!
And now that she said that you to come sleep with me. And it's hurting you. Benita. What is this? And if my, my days are numbered like you said, of course you know I'm not in this house. You know I would never leave this house because that man can never lose his chance of having a lineage over a common kidney donor. He will not do that. So I am not leaving. Get out of the back of the house. a common kidney donor. Really? That's what you call it? Ordinary kidney? <laughs> What's wrong, Benita? That same ordinary kidney you're talking about is the only reason Charles is still alive today. This is fun. Stop it. That's old news. Now, what, what is it? You, you just keep saying, you're saying all this kidney that kidney. What is it? Let the young man breathe. What is it allowing him to be? You keep saying it. What is it? You've given him kidney. You have given him kidney. Let him be. What is it? Every time you're crying over over kidney, 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 What is this? Let him be. Benita, what are you looking for? When I sit, I'll let you know. When you sit? Benita, this is my room. You do not live in this room. So whatever it is you're looking for is certainly not yours. What are you looking for? What makes this room so special? I ask you. What makes it so special? Oh no, you wait until I put to bed, until I drag you out of this room. Benita, this is my room. Okay, this is my peace and my space. You cannot bring your madness into this place. Take your madness out there. there go, go to the living room, the compound, but certainly not. Slow down. This is it. And, and what are you doing with those? Excuse me? What are you doing? Benita, please. Please. Let me have it. Why should I give it to you? Benita, give it back. Why should I give it to you? Benita, give it back. Benita. What? No, 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 no. You, 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 you jumped down to do what? No, no, no. What did you jump down to do? Benita. What? Do not push your luck. Benita, I do not want to rough and you. Let me have it. Give it back. Give it back. Benita. Ch Benita, I, Ch do, I do not want to hurt you. Benita. Give it back. Benita, I do not want to rough and you. Try this nonsense next time. God knows I'll beat you up. Nonsense. I told you to avoid this girl. You're not even strong enough yourself. So you're blaming me now? You're blaming me? This is my fault? I'm not blaming you. I'm just saying... This is your fault! Damn it! Charles, be a man and take responsibility for once. You brought this upon us. This is your fault! Can't you see? Must you always do this all the time? Blame me for everything! Everything. What am I supposed to blame? Why would you even pick up a fight with her in the first place? Why? Because of ordinary juice and the car? The car is not even yours. Why won't you let her drive it? She was not going to eat it. God. Charles. You just said this to me. After all... After all I have done for you... Uh, there you go again. Emotional blackmail. All the time. Emotional blackmail? Really? That's what you call it now? I'm blackmailing you? Uh, babe. I am grateful you gave me your kidney. 
thanking you so much. I am forever grateful to you. Alright? But at the same time, I'm human. I've got feelings. Must you bring this up in all of our conversation? Must you? Charles, can't you see? Can't you read the writings on the wall? Why are you so insensitive to what is going on? Charles, it is not about your car. It is not just about my juice. Charles, there's a stranger in our midst. A stranger you brought into our home. And she's gradually sharing things with me, with us. Just like that. I mean, who knows what will be next? Maybe our room. Maybe this bed. She already threatened to throw me out of this room. And you want me to sit down and just watch? It's just a threat. Charles. Charles, I gave you my life. Charles, I put my life on the line because of you. Charles, you needed a kidney. I didn't think twice. I gave it to you. That is sacrifice. That is love. Charles, if you think you can make a mess of all that and call it blackmail, I'm surprised. Look, I'm going to make one thing clear to you. Charles, <laughs> as long as long as you still have my kidney inside of you, you are forever indebted to me. Did you hear that? You're forever indebted to me. Benita. Mm -hmm. Benita, what's this? Huh? Benita, why would you do this to yourself? How dare you drink yourself to stupor? You're pregnant for God's sake. She can not allow me out. It's in this house. She will disturb me. She won't let me eat. She won't let me drink. So I stepped up to have some air. Some mm. air? You mean drinking yourself to stupor? Benita, you're carrying my child. Mm. I don't want anything to happen to that child in there. Mm. No, no, I didn't drink too much. Just you are drunk! Okay, thank you. <sighs> Just I want to sleep. I'm, I'm taking you to your room now. Mm -hmm. Get up. Get up. Up! I'll take you to your room, okay? I want to lay down here. Mm -mm, I want to sleep here. Benita, you can't sleep here. Yes. Okay? You need a bed because of your condition. Yes, comfy. Okay.
I I love this movie so much. You do? Yes. It's my favorite too. <laughs> Are you serious? Yes. Well, I love it because it's um, similar to what's going on in my house. <laughs> ah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the guy has like uh, two <laughs> women in his house and um, he's trying to cope with them. Uh, I tell you, <laughs> live in hell. <laughs> ah. What would you say to live in hell? Sorry? Okay, don't, you want to stop? don't say what? Don't say he's live in hell. No, I wasn't talking about me. Guy. I've got my shit <laughs> under control, yes. I'm talking about them, him. <laughs> mm. He's bleeding. Yes, because the other lady's boyfriend came to his house. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> ah. Leaving her. <laughs> them. I was looking for you upstairs. I wasn't missing. Oh, well, I can see that. I'm going out. Take care. Okay. Um, is, is there anything you would like me to get for you on my way back? Just in case. No, you wouldn't want anything. You can please go. Excuse me. I am not talking to you. Chica, you were talking to me the moment you decided to distract our eating. Chica, I don't want anything. Alright? But if I change my mind, I'll let you know. It's good enough. That works for me. Um, by the way, I, I, I'll be gone for a while. I hope you won't, you won't miss me. Nope. Huh? Why would he mind? When I am sitting very close to him, I mean, he hasn't noticed that you, you've not come. So what is your problem? Why don't you just go and have fun? I am not talking to you. Hold on a minute, Charles. Are you going to sit here and listen to her? Disrespect me. Talk to me the way she likes. <sighs> really? Chica. Yes? Can you please go to wherever you want to go to? Huh? I don't want someone reminding me they're doing us here. Please. False, isn't it? It's a raw market for you. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Mama. I don't know why, but I feel my sisters aren't okay. Ah, okay. If you feel that way, why not pray for them? Yes, be praying for them always. Pray? Uh -huh, honey, Didian. Mama, how many times will I tell you that everything does not have to do with prayers? Even the Bible states that faith without work is dead. That is the reason they must put in action. <laughs> Mama, 
Mama, leave me. I'm telling you. 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 I'm you. I'm telling 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 you. I'm you. you. You have to go and get married. Eh? Let's see how you manage your own home. Mama. Mm. No marriage will frustrate me. Instead, I am Aka. Uh. I will frustrate the marriage. I am telling you. But the most important thing to me right now is that my sister should be okay. At least they should be managing instead of suffering. Because I am saying it though, Mama. If anybody is stressing my sisters, Sister Vero, Sister Chica, I will fight to. Malo ko godole ya, I will fight to. Hey, hey! Now I know every Bible quotation gas. Fighter, Mama, warrior. <laughs> Only for my sisters, oh. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. And you and your husband. Uh -uh. Fight for your sister. Leave me and my husband alone. <laughs> mm. Mama, uh -huh. I want to go to Joma's house. Hey, well, you are planning to change the topic. Or better still, run away from it. Hey, run to where, Kwan Mama? Is it not both of us that are, that are living in this house? Where am I running to now? I said, let me go and see my friend and I will be back. I said, Kwan Mama. Mama, make sure you come back early. Very early. So that we prepare something for your father. We. Eh. We. Moa. No, now, Gila. Mama. It was all. It can't be me and you. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Which one is me and you? You're, you're just telling me now to go and get married. And now you're telling me to come back so that me and you. Yeti kota kasere dunguri mba 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 Mama, go and cook for your husband. I'll be right back. I know you me ugo. Mama, I know you me ugo. Nde 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 la control family. Mama. Ah, Mama, make sure you come back quick. Mama, di. Make la tasi so. Hey hey. Eno kwa mama ki preach bye bye. Baby, where are you going? I'm going to a sitting room. For what? To sleep. To sleep? You no longer sleep here? I don't want to upset you. You don't want to upset me? I mean, like, since when did I say you upset me? Where is this coming from? Since you gave me your kidney. Baby. Baby, you're gradually slipping off my hands. You're pushing me away. But well, how? Not. How? How now? How am I pushing you away? Why are you doing this? I didn't bargain for all of this. I mean, think about it. I never knew a day would come where I'll have to practically fight for everything, fight for you, fight for our love. I mean, like, share you practically with someone else. And I mean, I'm new to this whole Countless situation. Countless times I have apologized to you. What else would you have me do? I'm sorry. Kiss me. What? You heard me. She's your fiance. Benita, what has come over you? What has come over me is that I need sex. 
Are you the first woman to ever get pregnant on planet Earth? Yes, I, I know. I am not the first person. That's why I'm asking you to go and make your inquiries. We need, we need sex. Yes, pregnant people, we need sex. That's why I'm asking you to give it to me. What is it? You're giving it to who does not deserve it? Who doesn't need it? What is your problem? What do you want me to do? Masturbate? Listen, I understand the situation. Um, you do not understand because if you understand, you do what I, 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 I asked you to do. Give it to me, you say no. Let me go outside and have it, you say no. What is it? What do you ever want me to do? What do you want me to do? What? Benita, as a woman, is there anything I have done wrong to you? You have decided to frustrate me. Why have you come into my home to take away my peace, my sanity? What have I done wrong? Question. What did I ever do to deserve all this? Why are you doing this? Why? Oh, so you still expect Charles to continue to sleep with you. I say this situation is not bad enough. Really? Why not if not? Why won't he do it? Don't, don't, don't I need it? Pregnant women! What am I even saying? Have you ever gotten pregnant before? You have never. So how would you understand? How would you understand my predicament? You can never. It's not possible. You can't. What is this? Uh, no, 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 please don't keep me that. No, 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 don't even bring that tears because I'm not even seeing it. That's what you know how to do. A, a, a cry and he will console you. That yes, he has consoled you. That is it. Hey, console her. Cry, cry, baby. Console her. Cry. Yes. Cry it. Cry me a river. Yes, cry. Take her upstairs. I know that's the next thing you will do. Move. Exactly. Go and give it to her. Since you refuse to give it to me, give it to her. Yes, give it to her. Just, 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 just look at her. You can never even, even, even tell her, tell him to give it to me. Give it to the person that needs it. You say no. I am pregnant for you. Do it for me. For the sake of your baby, you say no. Hey, look at it. Just, just, just. Cry. Conversation. Why not? Don't you have such a conversation with your mother? Ask her, my daughter. Ask her. Oh, good afternoon. Good afternoon, mom. Continue your story. Oh, who did you say the young man is? That's what I'm trying to find out from her. Because that day she said she was not in a good mood. I think that man made her angry or something. Amaka. Mama. Amaka. Mama. What happened? Mama, nothing happened. And I don't want to talk about it. You're very lucky. You're lucky you have a mother that wants to listen to you. My own mother. Mm. Now I want to be out my time. All she cares about is her own work. You're lucky. You. <sighs> the, the, the truth is that I... I don't even know how to say it. You don't know how to say it. Say it anyhow. Just say it anyhow. Anyhow. Say it. Say it. Let me hear. Mama, he said... He was telling me that day that... I don't know. He was just telling He me was what? just telling you what? Oh, where is he go? He was just telling you what? Mama, he, he said he wants to marry me, that's all. Are you serious? <laughs> hey! 
I'm not to marry you. Mama, that's the good news though. Hey, hey, mm, mm. Should I dance or what will I do for you? Why are you excited? Hey, 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 see ya, Amaka. Amaka is getting married. I'm, I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, congrats. Congrats for what? Why? I don't understand your excitement. Mm -hmm. You don't need to be excited. Mm -hmm. Mama, do you want me to become an enemy of progress? Hey, Mama, that man has a fine car and I think he's very rich. Mm -hmm. My daughter, mm -hmm. Amaka, somebody told you that he wants to marry you. You know, Zobia. My daughter, I am not after his money. Cha cha wa. My prayer is for him to be a good person. At least somebody that will understand. Somebody that can understand her. Eh? <laughs> Mama, wait, wait, wait. You are praying for who to be a good person? Which one? Which one? Have I accepted this proposal? You are already praying for a stranger to be a good person. And you, you are excited on my behalf. I don't understand you people know. <laughs> Amaka, you know huh? you are married to Arcelo. So we can't wait for you to get married. Marriage what if you get married? Marriage. Mama Beggy. Marriage to Arcelo indeed. Hey, hey. People are funny. Like, both of you are just seated here. Talking about me as if I am not even here. You already accepted the proposal on my behalf. And you, you are excited on my behalf. Somebody I have not even accepted. Have I even said yes to his proposal? What if I say I don't want to marry him? Will you people force me? Yeah. Amaka oh. Chuku. Amaka Mwam. Amaka Chuku. Mama. Uh -huh. Amaka, do you know the best thing to do? The most important thing you should do Try and bring that young man bring home. Bring which young man The home. young man, bring him home. Come no yanya, come ne yanya. Mufuya, at least. Mui kenyo cha. Shebi, you are happy now. You are happy, Abi? Ah, Amaka. Amaka, what Mama is saying is right here. I think you should bring that young man home so Mama can see him. That's the best thing you can do. Hey. Have you gone mad? Mm -hmm. I'm happy. Mama, my friend is getting married. Mm -hmm. You're dressed. Yes. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, where are you going to? I have a job interview this morning. What do I do with a job? What do people do with jobs? Am I complaining that you're not bringing money to the house? Well, Ken, I don't need to wait for you to complain before I go out there and get a job so I can bring something to the table. Better still, do you want us to switch the roles? I know it! <laughs> I said it! So you want to throw me to a vegetable in this house? Listen, I have a first hand revelation about it. Your plan has spoiled. You will never get any job as long as I'm still your husband in this house. Really? Yes. Then I want a divorce. What did you just say? I am sure you heard me the first time, Ken. I want a divorce. Why would you want a divorce? And why wouldn't I want a divorce, Ken? No, really, why wouldn't I want one? Because I don't understand what we are doing. What do you call this, Ken? No, what do you call this thing we call a marriage? Because as long as I'm concerned, this is not a marriage. This is not how marriages are. I've been hanging in there because of my kids. Because I don't want to leave my kids here and go. And now it has dawned on me that I should live for their sake. So I would stay alive and take care of my kids. Are you serious, you, you, you want a divorce? Ken, you know me very well. You know me too well to know that I don't joke around. I am tired. But I'll help, I'll help. 
else do you want me to say it? This is nine good years, nine good years of marriage, yet there is no certificate, not even a ring to show for it. I had to go to the market and buy this costume here and put it on so I will cover up our shame. Our shame! Your shame! Well, I am tired of this nonsense because I am better than this. Give me a divorce if you are tired too. Now I get your point. So because I refused to have a court wedding with you, that is why you want a divorce. Giving my mother food. Huh? Well, no one informed me she was coming. Does that answer my question? Ken, it answers your question because what I am trying to say is that I did not prepare food for your mother because I was not informed of her coming. Do you understand it now? Is that an excuse or what? Are you indirectly stabbing my mother or what? Well, she told me she's in her son's house. So I decided to let her be. I believe when the son comes, he will prepare food for his mother. Or are you ready to let your mother starve too? Vera, you are a witch. <laughs> Valin, if you're just realizing that now then, you did late. <sighs> Ken. Ken, I am tired of you disrespecting me in this house. I am tired of you taking advantage of any opportunity, the slightest opportunity, to insult me. I have had it up to here. I am not going to let it slide anymore. So I am going to look for a job with or without your consent. Thank God my mother is here. <laughs> and you think she's going to stop me? Oh. <laughs> Let's watch. Well, darling, your mother being here makes my plans easier. Oh. Like you said, let's watch. What happened? Mama, Daddy made holy crap for us one time and we couldn't have eat it. Hey, children. It wasn't that bad. Mama, I cheer up. Why would your mother be here and your father would be cooking? Moreover, it's not only the men that cooks. Who told you that? Mom is the only one cooking, so why are you not saying this? Gucci. Cooking is not meant for a woman alone, okay? It is okay for a man to help out in the kitchen. That makes him a good man. Mom, but dad never helps you in the kitchen. But does that mean daddy is a bad, bad man? Enough. Table manners. And what did I say about table manners? You no. don't talk too much when you are eating, right? Mm -hmm. Good. No. It's the woman that allows the husband to cook. That is the bad wife. Really? Yes. Buchi, Ada, finish your food in your room. But no. Now. Don't allow me to repeat myself. <laughs> Why 
did you ask them to leave? Because they are my children. They are my children too? No, Grandma. They are your grandchildren. He is your son. You control him the way you like. I don't interfere. So please, do not interfere when I'm controlling my children or training them. And, you and please, very important, don't ever counter my decision in front of my children. It's very disrespectful. And you want me to sit here and watch you tell these children that their father is a bad man? Well, if their father is not a bad man, what is he? Chimo. Hey, Ken. Is this what you have been enduring all these years in this house? Mama? Thank God you're here, Mama. This is what I've been experiencing in this house. Hey! Not under my watch would this happen. No! Uh -uh. Hey! Look at Vero. But I want to know. Why would you disrespect my mother like that? I did not disrespect her. I only corrected her. Vera, I know you can be crazy sometimes, but I do not expect you to bring that craziness to my mother. Oh, it is not okay to insult your mother or disrespect your mother, but it is okay for you to disrespect other people's mother. Can every now and then you disrespect me and insult me in front of my children? But I will not have anybody's mother come into this house and tell me how to train up my children or teach them any wrongdoings. And what do you call wrongdoings? Telling my son it is not okay for a man to enter the kitchen or help out in the kitchen in a world where men do virtually everything. Even when one's wife is a housewife. Yes, Ken. Even when one's wife is a housewife, men should help out. Men help out. So you expect me to go outside there and hustle? Take the heat and come back home. Yes. And do, 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 do yes, Ken. I expect you to go out there and hustle to take care of your wife and your, and your children and then still come back and help out in any way you can do. Other men do it. They don't have two heads. They have one head like you, just like you. So there is nothing wrong in you helping your wife, Ken. Well, since this is about bringing money to the table, I'll go out there and get a job. No, 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 and no, 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 Ken, you are not stopping me. You are not stopping me. I can see you're serious with this. Yes, Ken, I am dead serious. And you know your wife. I don't joke around. When I say something, I do it. I am going ahead with this divorce unless you will allow me be the woman I want to be. Thank God we did not do court wedding. Else you will say I'm about to dig. Whatever gold you have. Veronica, are you daring me? <laughs> this is a fact. <laughs> Veronica, mm -hmm. it is you that I have come to see. It is because of you that I've come to this house. Because of me? Yes. My son here has been experiencing hell in this marriage. <laughs> Mama, he told you so. Or... Let me land. I've not finished. You've been married for nine years. What is this issue about having got wedding? That you've been disturbing my son. What is going on? What is wrong? <laughs> Let me get something straight. So Kenneth reported me to you. And of course, I'm not surprised you would take sides. But Mama, since we are reporting each other to you, 
Please, can you help me ask your son why he has refused to do a court wedding with me? Because really, I want to know what his fears are. You don't answer my question with question. You've been married for nine good years. You have two beautiful children. You did your traditional marriage. Eh? Everybody knows that you are married. What is all this about having caught wedding? Your husband doesn't cheat on you. Cha cha. Eh? What does a peaceful woman want? Mama, a peaceful woman wants a caught wedding. A caught wedding. Because really, I don't know what the big, the big deal is all about. What is the big deal about it? All I ask for is a court wedding. Like you rightly said, we've been married for nine years, Mama. There is nothing, no evidence to show that I am married to this man. Not even a certificate or a ring. I had to buy this one in the market. Not even a white wedding. What is the big deal in asking for a court wedding? You're reporting me to your mother. Mama, ask her why she doesn't want a church wedding. If she doesn't have ulterior motives. Ken, please, can you stop this bullshit? Who is talking about a white wedding after nine years of marriage? What will I do with a white wedding, really? Mama, I told you. I told you this girl has plans. Oh, my plans. Veronica, it's obvious you have plans. Yes. You want to kill my son and run away with his property. Jesus. Mama, how can you say such a thing? Where is she going? Come back here. Come back here and hear the truth. Ah, shit. Hmm. Hmm. I can't believe that this girl will be like this. V. V. I, I, I am sorry. I, I didn't need to escalate to this point. I'm sorry. Okay, now it's V. It's V. You now call me V. Can I see you and your mother are hell-bent on frustrating me to my last breath in this house? No, that's what the agenda is because it's becoming clear to me. Uh, honey, I am, I am sorry. But will you still go ahead with the divorce? Watch me, Ken. Watch me. Uh, who is there? Come right in. The door is open. Mommy. Sweetheart. Uh, what is it? Is it true you are separating with Daddy? Who told you that? Grandma. She said you will no longer be, with, be living with us. Sweetheart, come here. It's not true. Grandma was only joking, okay? Yeah. Really? Of course, you know Grandma, she jokes a lot. She was only joking, okay? Joking. Hmm? Don't worry. Your daddy and I are going to spend the rest of our life together, okay? Is that what okay. you want? That's my boy. Come here. Come here. Oh. Okay, don't worry. Go to your room. I'll come and see you later. Hmm? Give don't me worry. high five. That's my boy. <laughs> I will. I know you're hungry. Look at his tummy. I'm coming, okay? Do you see the influence your mother has over my kids? It's all your fault. When you're screaming, divorce, 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 as if you won a lottery. I don't blame you, Ken. I don't blame you at all. Getting a divorce it will not solve our problem. And now the kids are aware of the divorce. Are you still going to go ahead with the divorce? <laughs> um, my love, your your mother is not back yet. When is she coming back? I honestly don't know what is keeping her away. She doesn't always take this time. No, because of the road. It's getting late. I understand. Okay. So, tell me, what is your decision? On what? 
um, consigning what we, we discussed the last time. I don't know what to tell you. What do you mean you don't know what to tell me? Amaka, I just want you to say yes to me. Huh? Once you say yes to me, I am very okay. Obiora, I feel like marriage is a trap. A trap? Yes. Come on. You already know I like you. In fact, I, I love you so much. You know that. I love you with all my heart, with everything in me. I can do anything for you. I want you to be my wife. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Please, let me marry you, okay? I will take good care of you. Anything you want on earth, I will make sure I provide it. If I don't have, I can possibly go out and borrow just to make you happy. Huh. This one you are, you are telling me to say yes to you. I, I, I am not okay. Oh. Normally, my brain, they do somehow. If my nuts lose like this, everywhere go they scatter, scatter. It's just so you know. And I am not ready to tolerate any nonsense from anybody. Oh, come huh. on, Amaka. Huh? How do you see this man sitting before you? I'm a responsible man. I will treat you like a queen that you are. I will take good care of you, worship you, make your dreams come true. Hey. I will make sure that you lack nothing. As a matter of fact, once you accept to be my wife, our first child will be delivered in London. <laughs> Obiora, I am holding my ears now. I know, I am serious. Okay, I'm a serious young man. I don't joke. Did you hear that thing I said before? I said my not usually lose like this. And if it, if, if words, it goes off... stubborn. Yo, I, I don't care. I don't know how you see it. I don't though. care. What I care about is this beautiful girl here. And I believe that once you stay with me, you will, all these things you're saying won't be. Because I will kill you with love. Eh? I will destroy you with happiness. <laughs> eh? You will lack nothing. You won't stress yourself about anything. I am dead serious, my dear. Just say yes to me. That's all I need. That's all. Okay, if you're serious, yes. <laughs> like, yes in what way? Go and bring your people. People should come now. That's the yes. It's a lie. I'm not joking. It's a lie. <laughs> I like... You, you, you're serious? Like you have accepted me, you have accepted my proposal, I should get my people? On the ground that you, you, you keep to your promises, oh. What are you saying? Are you serious? I should go with my people, that's just, that's just it? Huh? <laughs> I should just go with my people and, and, and then yes, you, are, you have accepted to marry me. <laughs> really? Of course. Oh. Amaka. Mama. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, ma. My dear, you're welcome. How are you? I'm fine, ma. Um, Mama, this is Obiora, the one that I spoke to you about. Oh, Obiora, you're welcome. Thank you. Ma, I must say you are very beautiful. And I see where your daughter, Maka, got her beauty from. <laughs> Thank you so much, my son. You're welcome. Thank you, you're welcome. Um, Amaka, have you offered him anything? Like what, Mama? Like what? Amaka, your visitor. You've not offered him anything. Mama, he ate before coming now. Mama, I'm, I'm okay. Yes, I ate before coming. Uh -huh. I'm fine. As a matter of fact, I was even about leaving. Yes! Mama, he said he's about leaving. So stop worrying. No problem, my son. Right. Don't worry. Next time you come, just notify me. I'll prepare Onubu soup for you. Oh? Alright. Before I leave, Mama, oh. I have some. Excuse me. <laughs> I'll talk to you for you, Mama. Mama, what, what, what hey. am I What am I supposed to give him? He ate before coming. You have started though. Mama? Um, Mama, please manage this little token. Please. Yeah. Get something for yourself, please. Thank you so much. Manage it. My son, this is beyond manage. It's too much. 
Eh? Mama. Mama, I beg to take my leave now. I will see you some other time. Okay. When next you come, hmm? Just let me know. It's okay. Let me start going now. Okay. Okay. All right. Take care. Bye bye. I'll call you. Bye. See him off now. No, I'm, I'm, I'm he's okay. going, Mama. Bye. Okay. I'll find him. Bye bye. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Ma. Thank you. Thank you, Ma. Amaka, bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. Mama, look this way now. Ah, don't do like that. Okay. Call the old. Where's the one? Mama. Hey. It's okay now. You have a good home like her. Hey. I have a good home like her. Amaka. Oh, what can I be like? Sit down. No, look at her. Amaka, you. Mama, don't come and start to. Oh. Don't come and kill okay. me with questions. Hey, hey. This one is not killing you with questions. Amaka. Is this young man, this handsome, so clean, elegant? Yeah, I'm not going too much. Amaka, is it this young man you are taking your time to accept his proposal? Amaka, this is the kind of man our society calls husband material. Mama, hundred years old with lining. Nka abro kwa nki betesi ya ichoba lining na ya. Nka ubu ubu ebiya. Muke maruma. Amaka, what is wrong with you? Tell me, eh? Mama Zukwanike. Ah ah. <laughs> Mama, see, I just want to be sure Obiora wants what I want. That's <laughs> all. Oh. Amaka, what signs do you need to be sure? Amaka, you will be here fooling yourself around until all these small, small girls will snatch him away from you. I don't know the possible. Oh, do now possible at all, at all, Mama. Amaka, Mama. It's not the level possible. Yes, sir. Amaka, oh. If this man gets tired of chasing you around, following you around, he will channel his energy to another direction. Oh, name Maro. Mama. Mama basically speed. That will never happen. It's not possible. Hey. Why are you so sure? That is because. Mama, don't worry. You don't have to worry. Amaka, talk to me. Hey, why your mama dogum? Tell me the truth. I am your mother. Mama, I'm not no. I am saying that I'm sure because. Talk to That's me. That's it. Mama, you asking too much questions. Just don't worry about it. So tell me the truth because I don't believe you at all. Mm. Okay, Mama. See. Uh -huh. I said yes to Biora's proposal. Uh, 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 I didn't believe you. Ah, I didn't believe you. Mama, you asked me, oh, I just told you now, you're telling me you don't believe me. I said yes to him now. Just like that. It's your cool. Mama, why why do you think he was hugging me in excitement? Ah! Mama, I don't I don't even Mama. I'm not Hi! So now finally both of you have concluded that he's going to marry you. Uh, Mama, I only said I accept it. Mama, see, now Mama. that I've accepted you, hey. if you say Namaka get married, Namaka get married, hey. and you're saying my husband is hey. 100 yards, you will buy me chicken and bread. You know I will do that. <laughs> but wait, oh, bread and chicken. It's bread and butter that I want. Mama, it's not your business now. Nah. I mean, I want to eat bread and chicken. It's a good combination. Babe. I know this is so hard for you right now. But please. I need you to be calm and patient for me. Alright? Charles. Baby. Yes, baby. Why? Why did you do this to me? This is... This is too much. It's too much for me to handle. I know. <clears throat> the 
Anita. What do you want here? I've been waiting for you in the room. <laughs> waiting for me how? Do we have an agreement? I want to have sex. What? You heard me. Who told us? Huh? What do you mean you want to have sex? Like we've been having sex in this house. This hot afternoon. Benita. Do they have timetable for sex? I'm asking you. Is it not when you're honey that you that you that you have sex? I'm honey, I want to have sex. Hey, oh my god. There's nothing I'll not see in this house. Benita. Charles. Get out of my room now. If you say I should leave, Charles, if I leave this room, I am going to have it outside. News flash. I don't care. You can have it with 20 men. 30 men. I don't care. But what I want you to know is I will not let you come between my woman and I. All right? Now get out of my room! I'll have it outside, Charles. Benita. Charles. You're pregnant. Do not let me lay my hands on you. Else! Get out! Charles, you're telling me to leave if I go out. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out. Nonsense. Can you imagine that nonsense? She wants to have sex. She's horny. Like... Babe, babe. Babe, come on. Babe, come on. Come on. Don't do this. Don't do this, please. Don't do this. Everything is going to be fine, I promise you. Okay? Don't do this. Don't do this. Babe, <laughs> don't do this. It's very obvious that nobody wants me in this house. Nobody. No problem. I will leave. And when I leave, I will travel outside the country and go have my child. Travel and go have my child. It's obvious nobody wants me in this house. I will leave.
tired. I cannot, I cannot do this anymore. Charles is driving me crazy. I, mom, I, I'm, 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 I'm exhausted. I, I don't think I can I don't think I can do this. I can't do it anymore. I'm tired. I'm tired. <laughs> Mom, please. Help me tell Amaka to come over. I've been trying to call her all day, but her number is not connecting. Please tell her to come. Please. Okay, Mom. I'll try. Bye. Mama, Mama, you look worried. What is the problem? Your sister called Chica. My sister? Hope she's okay. Mama, did she say anything? She was crying when she called. Amaka, I think that house is no longer conducive for your sister. Why was she crying when she called you? Mama, I hope no one is hitting her there. I don't know. All I know is that she was crying. Mama, do you know what? Mm. I'll be leaving here for the city first thing tomorrow morning. Mbao, no. You are not going anywhere, Amaka. Why? You are not going anywhere. Mama, stop now. Nothing will happen to her. No, you want them to kill my sister before I act? Nothing will happen to her. Just hear me. Nothing will happen to your sister. Inugo, you are not going there. Amaka, you want to go to that place to ferment trouble. Mama. Christian Sobu again. You just told me that my sister called you and was crying. And you think she's not comfortable with uh uh. Let me go and be sure she's okay. That was the only thing I want to go there and do. And what I been I don't want you to go. Sit back here. 
Mm. Mama, mm. there is no problem. I will not go anywhere like you've said, though. Mm. But I hope they don't bring your daughter in body bag for you. God forbid! To fear for but, Amaka, Mama. nobody is killing your sister. You only want to go that place to ferment trouble. Uh -huh. Amaka, I'm an money. No, now, which trouble again? You are the one that just said my sister. You've been worried though. And meanwhile, if I don't even ask, you will not tell me. You just said my sister called and was crying. And you, you said you think she's no longer comfortable there. Let me go and know what troubles are now. Is it not simple? Don't I won't go. go. There's no problems. Mm. Please, you are not going anywhere. How? Why you said all of this at the market is not there and her phone is still switched off? Huh? Nay, I have searched everywhere in this house and Maka is nowhere to be found. Are you sure she slept in this house? Because I have not seen her since I came back. Nay, I am sure, very, very sure, because I was with her last night in her room. In fact, we discussed until she slept off and I now went into my room. Even today, she woke up and did some house chores. I even sent her to buy me something, which she did. Huh? What? I hope you know what I'm thinking. Has she been kidnapped? God forbid. No. In fact, I am suspecting that she has gone to meet her sister Chica. Are yes. you sure about that? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. You know, I told her not to go to Chica's place. But you know your daughter, A Amaka, now. Amaka will like to do that, which you ask her not to do. I know, though you don't need to lecture me on Amaka character. Go and get your phone. Let us go, Chica. Go, 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 go. Hey. Go, Chica, let us know what okay. is going on. Okay. Eh? Everything won't problem. Somebody will not rest in this house. Amaka is 
What kind of daughter is this? What time for now? Say so. Can I watch it? I'm coming. Oh. Benita, I guess, the lady that is pregnant for our boyfriend. Excuse, excuse, excuse me? Not to worry, because I am also pregnant for him. That's a lie. And why, why should I lie? Relax, I am here to stay. We are pregnant. You are here to stay. Just like you're staying. That's my bag. You're here. Thank you. Goodness. So, Mama told you. I'm really happy she told you quickly. Thank Mama. You. Yeah. Goodness. I didn't expect it to be this fast. Who's but I'm Mama? happy. What? <laughs> Sister, you talk as if you don't know our mother again. Mama never wanted you to be here. Uh -uh. So, how did you make it here? Uh -uh. Amaka. Ah, uh -uh. you supposed to know me now. I just have to, one way or the other, find my way. <laughs> I sneaked out of the house. Jokes hey, are whoa. <laughs> are you serious? Yes. Mm. Meanwhile, what did you tell that, that mad one? What did you tell her to make her change her mood? Her mood is so bad. Mm. What happened? Nothing. No. Did you say anything to her? No. When I came in, uh -huh. she asked me, Who are you? And I answered her, This is who I am. She got angry with her big belly. Boom. Just like that, sister, no worry. I carry violence from village waka come. Hey! I, I trust you. But well, please, let me just advise you. You see that girl? Avoid her. She's a basket of trouble. Uh, Did you hear me? Avoid mm -hmm. her so that you can live here in peace. Mm. Sister, let me also tell you. I work her with violence come. And you should know that it's always good to have a mad person. Just one person that is very mad in every family. Now me be that. And you are the bad one. I don't call. Hey, Amaka. I don't call. Little Miss Fire. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy you're here. Why would you ever stop this nonsense? Why do you keep bashing into my room? When you start putting those things in between your legs in one place. Meaning? Meaning you're a useless man. You? You're a he-goat. Irresponsible swine. That's who you are. Enough, mm. Benita. What's the meaning of this? The meaning is sitting shamelessly in the sitting room. And what is in the sitting room? The village girl you pregnant at. What? What the hell are you talking what about? What is what? What is what? Why don't you go downstairs and see for yourself and stop asking me that stupid question? Move and go and see what, 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 what you've done to yourself. We're now to. Move and see. Go and see for yourself. Eh, let's go. Where is she? Where is she? I, I left her here. You left her here? Then where is she? Where is she? Are you asking me? Amaka. Hello. You. Yeah. Tell me you were coming. Yeah, that's because it was an emergency. An emergency? What happened? She's sick. 
My sister is sick. She's sick? How? Brother Charles, how could you? How could you even think of treating my sister badly after everything she has done for you? Um, Amaka, it's not what you think, <laughs> all right? Um, it wasn't intentional. <laughs> Trust me. Do you men ever do anything intentionally? It's always a mistake. One way or the other, you come out to tell us that it's a mistake. Come on, Amaka, you can't, you can't talk like this. No, I'm not talking anyhow. The thing is, I am just here to make sure my sister is fine. And I hope there will be peace in this house. Um, Mama, I'm here to see Amaka. Hmm. I've been calling her, but her number is not reachable. My son, Amaka, traveled. Ah, traveled? Yes. But she never mentioned that to me. It was an emergency. Her sister is not feeling fine, so she went there to help her. Oh, really? Okay, I see. Sorry about that. Thank you. Uh, but is there a way I can, I can assist, I mean, financially, for her to be okay? No, my son. Amaka is already there to help. She mm. will take care of it. Okay. I hope the sickness is not severe. No, 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 no. Okay. Sorry. Thank you. Sorry. I mean, that is why I'm here. I, I was worried. Thank you so much. Okay. All right. I, I will start going now, Amma. Okay, my dear. Uh, okay. Mama, please. Uh, do you know when she's coming back? Mm. I can't answer that one. Okay. You know what? You have to keep trying her number. Um, whenever I start going through. Okay. She's in a right. better position to tell you. All right. I will be calling her. I will be calling her constantly. Mama, I hope you're okay. I'm okay. Thank you. All right. Full Thank stop. You. Everything is fine. Thank all right, you. Thank you. Okay, ma. I beg to take my leave now. Right. Thank you. Welcome. Uh, let me start going now. Okay. All right. Uh, okay. Send me away to your family. Okay, my dear. Right. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Oh, my regards to your family. Oh, sure. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. All right. I will oh, keep calling her. Oh. All right. Take care. Oh, guano. Oh, guano. Welcome. Oh, dear. Hola. Nay. Who was that? Hmm. The young man I told you that wants to marry Amaka. Oh. Uh, I hope there's no problem. No. He came to look for Amaka, but I told him that Amaka traveled. <laughs> hmm. I wonder what he sees in Amaka. If only he knows the bag of trouble he wants to buy. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Biko, 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 Biko. I don't agree with you. Cha, cha, kwa. Yeah. Eh? You should stop talking like that. Too. Amaka is a good girl. She's still a good girl now. Uh, I'm a <laughs> The best she's not a good girl. All I'm saying is that uh, the young man should come and do the needful so that uh, she will even be a better girl in his house. Ah, no, I can't wait to. If you want to hear love, you Hey! You can love what? Amaka loves him. If you no, go broke on bearing love. Hey, don't mean it. Hey. Uh, let him come and do the nephew so that they begin to love themselves. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait. I hey. can't wait to see hey. that. Hey. Amaka. Mm -hmm. Veronica, where are you coming from? I went for an interview. Which job interview are you talking about? Leaving the kids to starve? How can the kids starve when their grandmother is here? Meaning what? Is her mother now the new house half or slave? Ken, how can your mother making food for her son and her grandchildren be slavery? Hmm? Like where is that done? What are you even talking about? Veronica, so you want to tell me that you can leave this house without telling your husband where you are going? Hmm? 
He was sleeping when I was leaving. We slept in December last night. Why didn't you talk about it? No one fixes an emergency job interview, Veronica. Well, mine was. The slot wasn't actually mine. It's my friend's own. She had to call me to, to utilize the opportunity so it wouldn't just waste. And, and I had to. And um, fortunately for me, I got the job. She got what? What job are you talking about? I got a job, Ken. My mother does not live in this house with us. So who takes care of the house shop and other responsibilities? Ken, we will get a help. Veronica, this is a joke. Well, I'm sure you know I don't need your help to do that. As a matter of fact, I've gotten a help. I'm waiting for Mama to go so she can commence work. Oh, so you want me to leave my son's house so you can kill him for me? Barney. Mama, please, enough of this kill your son, kill your son. Don't you think if I wanted to kill your son, I would have killed him long time ago? Don't you think so? You didn't know. Eh? Mom um, knows uh, uh, Ken! Did you see what she did? Eh? Are you going to just leave her like that? Oh, okay, no, Ken, you have spoiled this girl, oh. Eh? Because a whole slap would have reset her brain now. Slap who? Hmm. <laughs> Oh, Ken, you cannot slap her. Hmm. After what she did to your mother now. Hmm. Hmm. Ew, I will have to leave this house. Hmm. Ew, I will have to leave. I will have to leave this house. Because she has already said it now that I should leave. Eh? So, this woman is... Is this what you see in this house? You can't even control your wife. Ew! Can't stop now. Stop. Stop. Ah. What's the problem? Now? Can't I have my wife? Eh? Your wife is tired, Pico. I'm tired. <sighs> tired because you went for, 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 for a job interview? Huh? Eh? If you get so tired like this because of a job interview, how down would the job itself be? Can, 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 can you just allow me sleep? Eh? The venue of the, the interview was really far. I had, to, I had to trek at some point and there was traffic to crown it all. Ken, please now, let me sleep. Be cool, no? Let me sleep. It's okay. It's okay. Can, can you just give me only one? Just one. I'll be okay Ken, with stop one. now. You're not even getting a peck. I'm tired. Uh -uh, can't you understand? Another time. I am hard now. If I work a quarter, eh, I am hard. Enter the hard. bathroom now. Enter the bathroom. Oh. To do what then? You know what to do. Enter there and use whatever you're supposed to use. Allow me to have one. Please. Can't Just... stop now. Can't stop. You're beginning. This is be becoming harassment too. This is becoming harassment. Ah uh ah. -uh. If I say I'm tired, I'm tired. Have no marker. Leave me alone. If you want me to leave this room for you, I'll leave it too. I'll go to the parlor and sleep. Just one. Enter the bathroom. Just one. Enter bathroom. If you try it now, you may like it too. Can. Can. Okay. Mama, good morning. Mm -hmm. You're still here? Meaning? Yesterday you were shouting, I want to go, I want to leave this house. I need to leave this house, like something was burning you to leave this place. So I was thinking by the time I wake up this morning, I won't see you here. So you want me to leave my son's house? <laughs> but Mama, you don't live here. I mean, this is not your house. This is my husband's house. So at some point, you're supposed to leave. What has come over you? How dare you talk to me like that? This is not a shouting matter now. This is a very simple matter. I'm being as polite as possible. Mama, this is not your house. 
This is not your husband's house. This is my husband's house. And Mama, I am sure in your husband's house, nobody comes there to control you. Nobody dares control you in your husband's house. Asremasi. So I don't understand why you will leave your beautiful, comfortable husband's house and pack all your things and come to my own husband's house to control me. Mama, it does not make sense now. It will make your sense. I will cut off these wings, eh? These dirty wings you got from your, from the quarters for you. Mm. That is if you remain in this house by the end of the day. Veronica. That is my name, Veronica. What can I do for you? Mama Biko, 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 Biko. I've been trying to play cool. Go have it, can bury my, my mother-in-law. Eh, please, go into the guest room. Did you hear what I called it? Guest room. You are a guest in this house. Go in there and pack everything that belongs to you and leave. How dare you? You don't have any right to talk to me like that in my own son's house. Mama, actually, I, I, I have all the rights in the world. In fact, I have more rights than you anywhere around this house. If it's not my son, eh? I would have, I would have stopped this your stupidity. Mm. I would have shown you the other side of me. Mm. What other side? <laughs> Mama, you will not do anything. Please go in there and pack your things. I quit your wedding. Cut a wedding. Over my dead body. Would you have one? Vero, why would you be speaking to my mother like that? What has come over you? The same madness that came over you, Ken, that makes you talk to me the way you please. That's what came over me. She is my mother, Vero. Oh, Stop. really? Stop. Stop pushing your love. So, because she's your mother, I should take her frustrations. She should frustrate me in my own husband's oh, house. Come on, you and I know that she's not going to be here for so long. So, why not just endure her? Eh? If you think you are going to invite your mother into this house without my consent and expect me not to get mad, then I don't understand you. Or you think you're just going to invite your mother just like that and expect me to be calm about it. Is that what you think? Very in case you have forgotten, let me refresh your memory. I own this house. I bought this house with my own hard-earned money. Therefore, I don't need any permission from you to invite my mother to my own house. You own this house. Oh, yes. I see. Well, since you do not see anything wrong in what your mother is doing, fine. Well, I don't care. Henceforth, how this marriage works. Oh. Do you understand? Like you ever cared before. Do you care? Of course and you don't. And Ken. I will take your mother's frustration as much as I can to the best of my ability but please let her stay off my kids she is bad influence to them what you heard me right ken ada have you noticed something what is that she's drama king mom and dad has been fighting but they always fight i know but it's increased what should we do about this I think we should go and ask them what the problem is. Wow. That's a good idea. Maybe during dinner, wax them. Yeah, during dinner. Ah. <sighs> Yes, it's true. And we noticed it got worse as soon as Grandma came. But you stop. Where did you get that from? But Mom, you always say your voice is from our room. Yes, it's true. People are getting it all wrong. Your mother here wants your father to do court weather with her. What does that mean? It means that if anything happens to your father, your mother will run away with his property. Mama, will you stop? Will you stop this this minute? Mom, is that true? But is anything going to happen to dad? 
um, nothing will happen to me. Okay? Okay. Yeah. Buchi? Yes, sir. Ada? Yes, sir. Finish your food in your room. Oh, no. Now! address what just happened on this table right now. Veronica, what do you want me to say? What do I want you to say? Well, Ken, for the first time, I actually want you to be the man. The man you've been making noise about being in this house. I want you to be it right now and address this nonsense that just happened now. You want my son to beat me now? Eh, oh, you're eh, walking away. Eh, let him come and beat me. He should come and beat me. Eh? Is there any other thing you can do? If not, just to send them. Girl, 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 my children. You are training your children. Tell my son to come and beat me. Uh, Ijoma, I don't know what is wrong with your friend. I mean, she traveled without letting me know. I guess it's an emergency. Emergency? Yeah. And she couldn't call me on the phone to tell me? When I told you that my friend is a nut case, you said you don't mind. So why are you complaining? So if if she is a nut case, she she can't tell me that she wants to travel. Uh, listen, Ijoma, I know you like me. Yes, but I don't have you know feelings for you. I'm not saying you're not beautiful, but Amaka caught my attention first. Okay, now. Go home and wait for her to pick your call, okay? Excuse uh, me. Yeah, 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 come. I'm sorry, okay? Come, come. Listen to me. The truth is, I so much love Amaka. I care about her so much and I really want to talk to her. I don't want her to change her mind towards me. I want to see her. <laughs> change her mind? You should pray she accepts you first. You're talking about changing of mind. <laughs> she didn't tell you? Tell me what. She has already accepted me. No. Are you serious? <laughs> of course, it's not a... It's not a... She has accepted wow. me already. Okay. Channeling your attention to someone I never cared. Hello? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Since you said she has accepted you, I'm happy. I'm so happy for you guys. Thank you. <laughs> I, I can't drag anything with my friend. No, I can't drag anything with that. Thank you so much. Thank you. So are you indirectly telling me that you, you will call her for me? Yes, I will. Okay. And I would also love to hear from her if she has truly accepted you. So, All right. talk to her. Okay. All right. Thank oh, you. Yeah, now I'll have to start going now. All right, thank you. I'll, I'll appreciate if you if you try to reach her and let me know, please. All right, I will. Okay, I'll take care. All right, thank you okay, very now, much. Okay, now bye-bye. Please don't forget, eh? I'm, I'm serious. No, I, I will really not. want to talk to her. I will. I will, I will call her. I will talk to her once I get to the house. All right. Oh, yeah, now bye-bye. All right. Please call her, okay? I will. Bye. It's been days. Go. Village, since this place is no longer conducive for Mama, me. Please don't go. Mama, please. It's not about don't go. I see me now, see village. I'm already in the village. I have to go and look after my goats, my chicken. I don't want them to kill me here. Mama, who is killing you? You don't know anything. Hmm? Witches everywhere. Witches. Mama, I'm not seeing anyone. No. Don't worry. I will come back for you, people. Hmm? Bochi. Yes, mom. Ada. Yes, mom. To your room. Well, I said crazy. to your room now. The, uh, Ken! 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 Come and take me out of here! Take me! Ken, where are you? Come and take me out of this place before they will kill me! Hmm? Eh, take me out. Let me go. Let me go. Uh, 
Daddy, go. Ah. I've been meaning to ask you. Why the rush? Why you the rush? This girl, did she carry go? Yeah. Hey, I don't understand you. Eh? What are you saying? Don't you know me too well? When I'm serious, you know when I'm serious, right? You see this girl, eh? She's the one for me. Mm. I must marry her. In fact, it will not take up to a month. She don't be my wife. <laughs> That's to show you how serious I am. Where did you say you met this girl again? Oh, man, a village. Oh. Village quoi? Yes, now. Let me tell you how it happened. I met her in the village. You know, I went to see my grandmother on this fateful day to, you know, give her food stuff. Usual. You know, yeah, my, yeah, yeah. No matter yeah. what they do. Yeah. So I met her. You see this girl? Hey! Very beautiful. Hmm. Beauty. She must be very pretty. I am telling you that this girl is... Beauty is an understatement. This girl is mummy water. If you see her skin, natural. No bleaching, nothing. Everything about her is just unique. <laughs> her lips, soft. Her eyeball. Oh boy, this girl, they melt my heart. I cannot wait to make her my wife. Are you serious? I'm telling you. Lips where you never even kiss. You I don't see and say soft. Very soft. This girl swept you off your feet. My brother will be only that one. <laughs> this girl brushed me off my feet. I did tell you. Huh? My brother. Any time where I talk about this matter like this, eh, if I even think about them, it they bust my brain. <laughs> Do you know that I cannot concentrate anymore ever since I saw that game? Are you serious? Hey, she's the one for me. Although, I don't make some inquiries about her. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I heard that she's very stubborn. Uh, she's a stubborn girl. But I don't know what's me at all. It no matter. Did you just say stubborn? Uh, I heard that she's And very... you still want to marry her? You want to go ahead? Why not? Now the stubbornness I won't marry, I'll be now the, the girl I won't marry. I want to marry her, I'll be people who are stubborn, they don't marry them again. No, 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 I'm not talking to you. I've not said that. Just that the gravity of the stubbornness is what I don't know. You don't know it now, I'm telling you now. Oga, oh, make you not go break your head. Hey, Uga, not me. Not me, you'll be all right. Don't say, person go, who be that? Even if not man, you go break my head for this life. I cannot walk. But leave that stubbornness out. I can handle it, mm. all right? She told me that she, she's traveling to go see her sister. Her okay. sister is sick. Okay. You understand? So immediately she comes back. Straight up. Wow. I'm marrying her. So sorry about that. Sorry about the sickness and other stuff. So we are preparing for marriage. Is that of course, of course, in a month's time. <laughs> My man! I'm telling you, bro. I'm happy for you though. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> but I was thinking, why don't you cut her? Like date her so that you can know her. Courtship. No, her character, everything, you know? It's good. You're sounding as if you're not from this country or you don't know what is going on. We are in the 21st century. This is the modern age. No time for all those things, my brother. Once you see this woman, anyone you like, go straight and marry her. No, no time to waste. Okay, I should be dating her now. Before you know, one guy will just come from nowhere now. Marry her. Then I'll find it. <laughs> no, now. This is the girl I want to marry and I will marry her. No time. Just prepare yourself. My brother, fear of the unknown. I didn't worry you. Nothing they happen. <laughs> Nothing they saw. <laughs> just prepare yourself, you understand? Because now you'll be my best man. You see that? Thing? No, no, I don't want to beg you for that kind of thing. I deserve them. <laughs> no. Am I right? Are you right? As no. your best man. As your friend. I don't care. I don't care if she's stubborn or not stubborn. <laughs> Once I marry her, now I will share my character. Bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let me just marry her. Enjoy. Let you me know, just marry her. Stand this. Giddy bar. As your best in you know. Now. Best man, I go get your suit. That one for you. One time. <laughs> you see this girl, eh? Mm. Asamwa. Asamwa. I should not talk on. Hey, 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 hey. What's going on? What is that? What is the meaning of that I just witnessed inside? What is it? What are you talking about? How dare you? I mean, how dare you toy with a woman's house? How, how dare you do that? You allow that thing into, into the house? Not just that she's even pregnant for you. What the hell are you talking about? Amaka, pregnant for me? Is that what she told you? 
Oh. I see she's tried very hard to step on your nerves and she has succeeded. I've never seen a Marcus panties all my life. And all my life, this is like the third time I'm seeing her. For your information, she's Chica's younger sister. Alright? Younger sister. God. Is that why you dragged me out like that? Ah. Okay. 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 I see. Oh, oh. <laughs> so, this is. <sighs> this is it. <laughs> she doesn't know me. She doesn't know me. By the time I am done with her, she wouldn't know when she would pack her bags and leave this house. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now it's making sense. Okay. Frying four eggs? How dare you? If you fry four eggs, how many will others eat? I ask you, how many will others eat? Benita, you should have spoken to me politely instead of yelling. Yelling? Speak to you. That like your who? Exactly. I should speak to you politely. What an insult. Huh? You're even smiling. Yes, I am. Because I feel pity for you. You're very stupid. Do you understand? You are very stupid. How dare you come into my house to fry four eggs? How many do you fry in your mother's house? Listen, the fact I allowed your sister into this kitchen doesn't mean you should follow her. What is this? Does this, does this place look like your father's kitchen? Don't try it next time, Mom. I, do I, not I, try it next time. Don't come into my kitchen. Do this kind of rubbish. Four eggs. You're wasting my eggs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Please, just, 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 just shut up. Please, don't, don't do this next time. Don't try next time. What you've been going through in this house. <laughs> what happened? Sister, nothing happened though. The egg you asked me to fry, mm -hmm. I added extra to so I can eat from it. Then Benita came from nowhere and started abusing me. To top it all, she even abused our family. And I hope you didn't insult back. Insult her? How can I insult her when I am planning to beat her up? Amaka, sister, did I hear you say you're planning to beat up a pregnant woman? Yes, sister. Mm -hmm. I will not just beat her. I will beat her so well that she might pass out. Amaka. Amaka, listen to me. 
listen, please, no matter what happens, ignore her. Okay? Just ignore her. Avoid her. The house is too big. You can live in this house without having anything to do with her. That is where you got it wrong. Me and you, we are not the same. She will abuse you. Then I will just ignore her. Who told you I can do that? Sister, would you respect me? I'm not going to feed If she abuses you, what? Um, hello? Hello, Ijoma. How are you? Okay, Amaka is here. Mm -hmm. All right, talk to her. IJ. Hello, IJ. How are you? Oh, so sorry. It was an emergency. <laughs> no, no, not like that. Not like that. The phone has been off since I came here. Look out on it now. Is that okay? Really? He came? Oh. IJ, sorry. Oh, you're no vase. You're too para. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll do that now. Is that why you're sounding like something happened? Bye, Biko. <laughs> oh. Sister uh, Maka, mm, my baby. Let me tell you something. Stand up from there. But what is the meaning of this? Eh? I ask you, what is the meaning? Oh, because I allowed you to put your bag in this room. Eh? It means you, you, you come, come to this room to lie down for what? Why would you lie down here? Stand up from there. Wait, Benita. Why did you hit me like that? You're very stupid. My friend, get, 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 get up. Get up from there. Just get up. Wait. Are you being serious right now? You're very stupid. Very, very, very stupid. What happened to the other rooms? So, why can't I sleep here? Why can't you? Why, why would you sleep here? I ask again, what happened to the other rooms? They are so unkept because no one stays there. Oh, they are so unkept because no one stays there. Amaka, when I came to this house, I cleaned up this room myself. So what stops you from cleaning any of those rooms, Amaka? What is it? So, you, you actually woke me up the way you did to say all of this. Maka, you must be very stupid. You must be very stupid for asking me that stupid question like your sister. You are very stupid. What am I even saying? I, I, I need to sit out because you people are trying to frustrate me in this house. You want to frustrate... I see here. Get up. Leave. Maka, get up and leave! It's fine. Stop screaming and leave. <laughs> Leave and don't mention my sister again. It's a warning. Just, 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 just get, get out. I'm leaving now. Eh, go, go, go now, go. I'm gonna go, go. I don't want to push you. Just go. Wear your slippers and go. You cannot even push me. What is this? I cleaned up this room myself. So what stops you from cleaning one of one of those rooms? Please come and go. <laughs> come to share 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 room with me. Sleeping here. 
Good what happened to the room? Good morning, sir. Good morning. Benita pushed me out of her room. Benita did what? Why? She she said that she cleaned the room herself and that since she cannot sleep in your own room, that I cannot sleep in hers either. That's crazy. Excuse me. Uncle, uncle, uncle. Don't go. What? Yes, I I believe you're going to work and I wouldn't want you to have a bad day at work. Don't worry. Uh, the, the best I can do is ignore her. I will clean one of the rooms and move my things there. I'm really sorry this is happening to you in my house. Thank you very much for understanding. Alright? I'll see you when I get back. Uh, Take care. Let me, have, let me have the khaki if you What khaki? This khaki is for my sister. I don't understand that. That is for Charles. He bought that with his money. Are you let his me. wife? Soon to be. And it will happen in your face. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Soon to be wife. Listen, if you don't leave my presence, just if you don't get out of my way, you will receive the beating of your life. What did you say? I said you will receive the beating of your life. Why don't you try it? Amaka, why don't you beat me? Try, no, 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 I want to see you beat me. Try it. Beat me. I am not my sister. Oh. My brain is doing tick tock, tick tock. I am not my sister. Oh. Get out of my way. And if I wear you, I will take Uber. Amaka, what are you even saying? If I wear you, I will take Keke or Kada to wherever I am going to. For your own good, oh, and peace of mind. <coughs> <laughs> I am pregnant, oh. Yes. Come on. Sister, leave me. Leave me. Let me deal with this job. What is wrong with you? Mama, mama, you must have been keeping quiet for her. Child. You think I am I'm my sister? Mama, mama, what is no, this? No, 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 no. Charles! 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 Charles, that's all you know how to do! Charles! Charles! Charles, your only hope! Charles! Charles, your only hope! Charles! Charles. 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 Stop it! You are the one that is enabling her! You are the one that is enabling her to be doing that! The meaning is that everyone in this house will eat whatever my sister cooks, including you. This is not your father's house. Hence, you do not have the right to cook whatever it is that pleases you. Maka, okay, you've now got oh, nerves. Oh, sure, I've got some nerves. A lot. You've got nerves? Yeah. 
but don't push your luck. Do not push your luck. What is this? I will make sure you leave this house the moment Charles comes back and find out that you pushed me to the floor. Now you, you, you messed up my noodles. I can't even explain what got into me. I am sorry. Please forgive me. Mm -hmm. See this pleading? This pleading is, is late and it's useless because you are living with your sister to your useless family. How dare you? How dare you, swine? As many times as you've mentioned my family, I swallowed it. Never again. Should you open your gutter mouth and mention my family? Ever again. Swine. Hola, Ako. Hola, Ako. Where is this woman? Hola, Ako. No. I will. I'm sorry. Where have you been? I was at the backyard picking the palm fruit. <sighs> Is that not Amaka's job? Why should you be doing that? Nay, I can't wait for Amaka to come back. Eh? I have to do it fast because rain is coming. I don't want rain to sweep it off. Okay, sorry, it's, it's alright. If anybody look for me, tell them I went for the Omonna meeting. Uh -huh. Nay, huh? Chica called. She sent her regard. Chica? Yes, sir. I don't know what is happening with Chica and that young man. This thing is taking forever. When is that young man coming to pay her bride price? No. I see if that is the problem. Which problem? What is going on? How? Biko, I've been thinking of a better time to tell you this. Amarom. What is going on? Talk to me. Is Chica pregnant? That would have been better. If she's pregnant. What is going on, woman? Talk to me. What happened to my daughter? Chica donated her kidney to that young man. Which kidney? What, what kidney are you talking about? Which young man? How? Nay, Chica, your daughter, donated her kidney to that very young man you know. Chica donated her kidney to Charles. How? Under gunpoint? Or was she drunk? What happened? And even after that, Charles did not consider it important to come and pay her bread price. Nay, Charles got another woman pregnant. And the lady in question said that Charles will not have the child if Charles did not marry her. They are all mad people. Both that lady, both Chica, both Charles, they are all mad people. My, he, he, he will be carrying my daughter's kidney and go and marry another woman. How? That is not possible. It will not going to happen. I will not allow it to happen. The only way forward is that he must marry Chica or give her back her kidney. That is all. Are you hearing me? So, you and your daughter hid this type of important information from me. Naibar, I didn't want to tell you because I don't know how you will react. You didn't know how I would act. So, I would have been clapping for them that a man like me would take my daughter's kidney and not marry her. You are hiding them from me. In fact, I don't even have both you and Charles and what what the what the and the Allah. Let me go to the meeting and come back. I will know what to do. My in fact, what is going on? The Allah and the Allah. How can this happen in my house? How? Hey, Chimo, how am I going to contain Chica and her father in this house? How? What sort of madness is that? How can she do a thing like that to you in your condition? Doesn't she know you're pregnant? Amaka! Amaka! Yes, uncle. Come here! Amaka, come here. Amaka. Uncle. Who told us? Who did this to you? Huh? Benita. What? Benita, why? Why would you do a thing like this to her? A human being, for God's sake. Why? Uncle, take it easy. I 
I don't know how she found out that you are aware of me sleeping in the parlor. So she started hitting me with a stick. I kept begging her to stop, but she wouldn't. I kept on begging her because I couldn't fight her because of her condition. Anita, why? Uncle, look at my hand. Oh my God. Don't touch it. Mother was telling her to stop. She now used her leg to match me. And she told me she would make sure that my sister and I leave this house. If not in peace, we will live in pieces. <sighs> Uncle, I don't know what I've done to deserve this. I really like her as a person. And where was your sister when all of this was happening? My sister was not at home. That was why she could just beat me like this. Anita, why? Why would you do a thing like this to her? Why? Where did you learn this wickedness from? First, it was you sending her out of the room last night. And now, you're inflicting pains on her. Why? Anita, why? For God's sake. This is my house. My home. Not a war zone. I'm supposed to come back from work and have peace in my house. And not all of this. What nonsense. Uncle, could take it easy on her. No, I will not tolerate this in my house anymore. I will not. Auntie, I'm sorry. I'm going to do it again. You forgive me. <laughs> When I tell you, say for outside, say I know well. You think say I'd play with you, Abby? I am a guy. I suppose they mental asylum. So when dealing with me, you must be smart because I am 10 steps ahead of you. I am watching you. I am watching every of your moves in this house. Don't try me. This is just the beginning. Sorry for what happened today. I never knew Benita was this heartless. To the extent of inflicting pains on your sister. God. Don't worry, darling. I will talk to her. I will get to the root of this. Alright? I will take care of this. I promise you. Okay? Babe, why are you not talking to me? I've told you I will take care of this. Okay? I will take care of this.
Guilty man. That is holding that played out this period. My guy, you no try. You no try at all. How do you mean? See, if your wife and your mother are at loggerheads, then it's your fault. It's the duty of a man to control both women. I mean, they listen to you. Why should you take sides? See, man, why do you always take sides with my wife? If I don't trust you as my best friend, believe me, I would have started suspecting you. That's my problem with you. You hate truth. And you like lies. You like recruiting small, small enemies. But you know you can't do that with me, right? No, no, no. You can't do that with me. It's a bad idea bringing my problem to you. Ken. Make your wife happy for once. Once! This is all this woman had asked for. All the years I've known you both. You called it one thing. Something that can destroy a man. That is what you called one thing. Okay, let me ask you. Why would a woman want to destroy a good man? Why? All she's asking for is assurance. It's trust, it's love, it's care, it's financial security. It's her right to ask. Tima, can I ask you a simple question? I'm listening. Why is my wife so bent on having a court marriage if she doesn't have ulterior motive? Why? Like you said, she wants a certificate. What does she need it for? Okay. I'm out of this. Better. I'm done. I'm done with this. this. Good. We should be talking about the economy of this country, not about marriage certificate, court wedding or whatever. <laughs> talking about the economy of the country, for me, is bad, bad, bad and bad. <laughs> My only option now, that to Jackpa. Jackpa, guy, my own kids was so four. You need a miracle, bro. Where the money day? Now miracle you need. <laughs> <laughs> But they have given me the option to choose where I want to work, either in the US or the UK, so I get to be! <laughs> oh my god! That is so good to be true. Honey, I can't believe it myself. To think that they are footing all the bills, they are taking care of everything as long as I'm accepting the job and ready to relocate. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, let, me, let me have it. Honey, that's it. That's it. Oh God, I'm so happy. Oh, I've been praying for this. I've been praying for this. I've been asking God. I'm so happy. Oh. I, uh, <laughs> Butchi, um, Shana, that should go upstairs, okay? But I said go upstairs, okay? No, I know. Upstairs. Come on. Upstairs. Come on. No worry, I'm coming. We're celebrating. <laughs> Honey, did you see it? Honey? What is the meaning of this? What do you mean, what is the meaning of this? Take a look at the column where you're supposed to field your marital status. You said a single man with two kids. What's the meaning? Well, Ken, this is an international company and I didn't want to lose the opportunity. 
For real? Uh, yes, Ken. Oh. Tell me more about that. The other day when I told you I was going for an interview. I'm listening. This was the job I was going to apply for. So? When I got there, there were so many other people wanting to apply for the same job. And there was only one slot left. I needed to do everything fast. They said I should fill the form and it has to be done then. There was no time for me to make anything available. So I had to fill the form. So it doesn't look like I'm on serious, considering the fact that it was my friend that got the job for me. So I filled the column single rather than married. You are not making sense to me, Veronica. What do you mean I'm not making any sense to you? I had to feel single because if I had filled married, I had no certificate to back it up. And that might cost me this job. My friend had to go through a lot to get me this job. And I didn't want to lose it. Everything happened ASAP. Veronica, if all you needed to fill the form was a marriage certificate, you should have told me. Huh? What will it cost us to get marriage certificate? Oh, really? Ken, were you even listening to me? Of course. I told you everything happened ASAP. It's still not making sense to me, Veronica. How is it not making sense to you? Because I've been begging you to give me a certificate to present when I'm asked if I was married. Oh, you didn't see the need. Now you've seen the need. What are you doing there? Are you asking me? Are you not seeing that I call really? Why are they calling me now? Do I know? But I should talk before they come up with you. They call. Feel which form, Ken? I already told you they've given me the job. I have the job already. You saw it yourself. And you feel the marital status as a single mother. You know why? I told you why. Veronica, what is wrong with you? Why can't you get it right just for once? What will it take you to tell me that we'll go to court, do the marriage, and you have the marital certificate? What will it take to tell you? It will take me nine years, Ken. Nine good years, which is a time I don't have. Veronica, why didn't you ask me? Why? Why didn't I ask of you? Of course, why didn't you ask me? <laughs> Ken, are you the one asking me this question? I've been asking you for good nine years. Nine years, Ken. And what did you do? Veronica, it's as simple as ABC. You should have asked again. Maybe, maybe I would have considered. Oh, really? I need a reason to ask you to take me to court and wed me, your wife of nine years. I need a reason to convince you, right? <laughs> well, news flash. I don't need it anymore. So, are you planning of traveling without me? Well, as you clearly see, it's me and my kids. Oh, though I'm not stopping you from coming. I don't care how you get there. Not possible. You think I need your validation? Veronica, I am the man of this house. Therefore, you have to take instruction for me and you cannot thwart my decision. My decision is final. Oh, really, Ken? I am not arguing the fact that you are the man of this house. And I will only obey your decision when it is not selfish, Ken. Ken, what is it this time? Tima, you won't believe me. <laughs> Anything is believable. You, what up? My wife. My wife got a job in USA. You see? She had me well. Jackpot! Congratulations, my man. I mean, hope they are putting the bills anyways. Oh yeah, they are putting the bills, but... Jamie's but but what? I mean, you should be happy. I mean, you, I, we should be drinking and jumping up. Why are you looking like this? You are not getting the point, T-Man. Okay. Fill me in. Good. My wife filled the form as a single mother with two kids. Kenneth, Njoku, all you want to do is kill this woman, bring her down. How can Veronica? Fill a form as a single mother of two kids. I mean, how? What happened? Oh, she, she, she said because never, she, she never had a wedding certificate. Okay, oh, this. She, 
she went for that to say that someone gave her this lot and the person needed her to flee from as soon as possible. Then the big question here is why can't we do the God marriage? Look, I have the contact, I have the connection. At the snap of my finger, I will do it. Now, Kendi, I mean, <laughs> sorry, I, I, I'm not laughing. You have the contact for the court wedding? Of course. Okay. So, um, what, do, what do you do now? That is why I am here. Ken, you know my advice always asks you. So, I, I have learned to keep to myself. No more word. No Go ahead and say it. Just for your head. Ken, I hate to say I, I told you, but... What, what? Just go straight to the point and say, shoot, that is why I'm here. Go and beg your wife. side of her. <sighs> but come to think of it, if I do not beg Veronica, things may go wrong. This is a difficult situation. It's a very difficult situation. What do I do? I need wisdom. Wisdom to tackle this situation. But in needing wisdom, the last thing I will do is to beg Veronica. Acting so uneasy lately. Are you okay? How can I be okay? Hmm? No, tell me. How can I be okay when I don't even understand the woman I married? What do you mean you don't know the woman you got married to? Don't you know me? Stop the pretense. You know what I'm talking about. Of course, I know what you're talking about, Ken. But what do you want me to do? Go and undo it. <laughs> I don't understand. How do you want me to undo it? Write them, tell them you're married. Simple. I don't Ken, are you saying I should go go back and refill every form I filled before? Or I should go back and tell them I made a grave mistake? No, is that what you want me to do? I don't care to know how you do it. Just try and find out how you do it. I don't care to know. So just do something. Ken, I am sure you know it is not possible. The deed has already been done. There is nothing anyone can do about it. And I'm sure you know this. You know I am not joking. So stop playing around. 
You have to start getting used to the fact that I am leaving this country in a few months' time with my children. And there is nothing I can do about it because the deed has been done. You are not going anywhere with my kids. I did not hear you. I said you are not going anywhere with my kids, Veronica. <laughs> then watch me do that again. No, you daring watch me? me do it. Are you daring me? Huh? Baby, eat your breakfast. Honey, what is it you're not eating? Nada, where is your brother? Go and call him quickly. Keep him. Call him. You guys are late already. You just have to prefer a solution before I kill someone. Look, I am angry. I've had it up to this place, demon. Ken, I, I need you to calm down. I know you are angry. I need you to calm down and as well, change your approach to this matter. Don't make it seem as though because you want the, the, to travel out now, you are interested in the court wedding. See, man, if you're expecting me to go on my knees and apologize to her, I am sorry to disappoint you. I can. I will never do it. Never. You are talking like we have another option. Of course. We we'll have a solution. Shoot. See, man, listen. I, I want you to come to the house and, and talk to her. Talk to who? No now, I uh, can no. <laughs> no now. You know it can't work. It uh, can no, work. no, no, it will work. But why did you say it can't? Okay. I have not seen your wife for a very long time. So? So from the blues I just come. Come over to your house, talk to her about something that only the both of you know. No now, Ken, come on, it can't work. Why? Why are you my friend? I'm sorry, Ken. I'm sorry. I mean, <laughs> this is something I, I mean, oh, I'm sorry. See, man. Okay, now this is me just asking for curiosity. What do you want me to tell her? Good question. Just come over to the house. Tell her that I have explained everything to you. Let her have a change of mind. Simple. <laughs> Simple, of course. I, I just come. Oh, come on, Ken. If it's that simple, you should have told her yourself. Oh, come on. You know women with their ego, eh? If I try that right now, you know, it seems like I, I, I am fanning her ego, eh? You will not understand because you're still single, you're not married. Yeah. You know, Ken, I mean, this is not me being funny, right? You just reminded me that I'm single. So what is my business? No. With a married man? No, that, 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 that's not what I mean. Oh, come on. Just come and tell her. I will just do the marriage as soon as possible. 
Trust me. You ready now? <laughs> you are ready? Of course I am. <laughs> this is not funny now. Come on, now, man. Now, Ken. Now, you know your wife has asked for this thing. For nine years. Oh, come on. Don't refer me to that. Don't refer me. Don't take me back. That was in the past. This is new. I am a new creation. All things have passed away. This is a new time, new era. Do what I ask you to do. Huh? Will you do it for me? Hi, T. What's up? Um, I'm alright, but fine. Everybody's okay. Oh, you want to talk to me? Okay. I hope there's no problem. Forgive who? Oh, you mean your friend? My husband? But truly, I bear no grudge against him. There's nothing to forgive. I know, I know. You know, um, I understand completely, right? Please, you know how difficult this country is right now. And now that there's, there's an opportunity for a better life, you can't leave him behind. T, you're making this sound as if I did it on purpose. Come on. There, there is nothing I can do about this. It's already late. And you don't expect me to go back and tell them I made a mistake when I was filling the form. Uh, besides, they've already given me the job, so there's nothing anyone can do about it now. He's very sad right now. I know, but... Is there nothing you can do? Uh, there's nothing I can do about it. I, I, I warned him. I, I told him to get this done once and for all. Very please, now that we have an opportunity, forgive him. Come on, T. You're making it sound like I'm a very wicked heartless woman if there's anybody who wants the success of my husband more it's me i'm his wife very we're truly sorry all of these are no strange things to me i know i've been part of this family all right he's feeling so sad right now i am sorry on behalf of ken i'm sorry on behalf of myself his friends his family please just forgive him please <laughs> there's nothing i can do about it i'm just i don't know Vero, I was never in support of all his actions. I, I told him many times, but please, all I ask is now that you have a chance to save your marriage, would you allow your marriage to go down the drain? Would you? For something that you have the power to change, forgiveness. When I was filling up the form, I filled the marital status column, married. But I just wanted to see his reaction. Like I care. I don't care whether he regrets his actions or not. Because it's too late. I tried everything possible. Everything possible to make this marriage work. But Ken was not coming on board with me. So right now, I don't care. Now that I've seen an opportunity to take my kids and get away from this marriage, I am not letting it slide. I'm not even taking any chances. You don't get it. I tried everything possible to make this marriage work, like I said. I called your friend several times to speak with him, to talk to him as a wife to a husband, to try with me, let's make this marriage work. But what did your friend do? Nothing. Rather, he went to the village to bring his mother to frustrate me and also influence my kids. That woman was teaching my kids nonsense. And when I talked, what did Ken do? What did he do? Rather, him and his mother said I was trying to kill him because I asked for a court wedding. That I wanted to kill him and take over his properties and called me a gold digger. Ah, T, please, please, please. I've made up my mind. You know, come to think of it. I was not truthfully between me and you, T. I, was not, I wasn't even interested in his properties. Besides... What properties does uh, Ken have? 
No, what property does Ken have? What, what, what and what? What is it that he has that I did not build with him? I built everything with him. We started from the scratch. You know the story now. So what exactly is Ken saying that I'm trying to dig? For him to call me a gold digger, my own husband, just because I, I wanted a court wedding so I would have a certificate as a married woman. Really, T, there's nothing to be sorry about. I'm just tired of the bullshit. I'm just tired of the bullshit Ken has been serving me from day one of this marriage. I am tired. T, have you been listening to me or was I just blabbing? Didn't you hear me say I tried everything possible to make this marriage work? I tried my possible best. Anything needed to be done, I did it. Whatever a good wife needs to do to put her marriage back together, I tried it. But your friend was not forthcoming. What am I even saying? Besides, if you had spent more time preaching this sermon to your friend rather than me, I believe we wouldn't be here today talking about this topic. See, please, I'll, I'll call you back later. I'm making lunch for my kids. They will soon be back from school. Okay, bye. You are very stupid. You are stupid too. I am warning you. I am not warning you. You are, you are looking you for my are trouble. Foolish. I will deal yes, with you. Yes, so you think you are pregnant? Yes, I am. You are pregnant. I am a cat. I am a cat. Come on. I am pregnant. What is all this? I will not take it. You and your sister are envious of my baby. Did you? Sister, Amaka, listen, listen to Sister, me. Sister, you told me Amaka, to stop and stop. Amaka, listen to me. Should I your name? Amaka, you're taking this too far. You're taking this too far. What was your mom? What was it? You have to calm down. What Amaka. You put an envious of me in this house. You're envious of me. Oh, my baby, you and your sister. What is it? Amaka, listen to me. Don't call Amaka. my sister's name again. Amaka, Amaka, listen to me. It doesn't matter. If what I is all this? Did I not tell you to mention my sister's name? Amaka, you did I not tell you. Amaka, did I not tell you to mention my sister's name? Did I not tell you? Amaka, did I not want one and one? Did I not want you? I said, Amaka, come to Amaka, 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 Amaka
Amaka. Amaka, listen good. I'm going out. By the time I'm back, I do not want to see you or anything that looks like you in my house. You're leaving my house today. Alright? You leave my house today. Not without my sister's kidney. Excuse me? Yes, you heard me right. But you actually think that I will allow you and that thing you brought in here to drain my sister, right? <laughs> you have a lot of things going on. Amaka, you almost killed someone in my house. And this is what you have to say? You killed my sister first. Yes. The very day you went against our family's wish and collected her kidney, that was the day you murdered her. To top it all, you got another woman pregnant, brought her into your home, and watched her incessantly maltreat her. Hold on, you, you actually think I will allow that to slide? You are joking. You know what? I don't care what you think. But as far as I'm concerned, you're leaving my house today. Today, you leave my house. Charles. Charles, you know to know me well. If you want to know me, go ask Benita. I know Bichika. I be Dandrawa Pepe. And if I enter your eye, I know the Greek come out. And yes, I will leave, but with two things. My sister and her kidney. Let me come back to this house and Come back to which house, Uncle? Which house you want to come back? Waka come and they wait for you. No, they verse. No, be by being angry. When you don't verse finish, come bring my sister kidney, give me. Make a carry and they go. Since I'll be chica. Be warned because I am not chica. Rubbish. to know everything is fine. Okay, we'll be is fine. Okay, you'll be discharged in, in two days. Alright? Okay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Alright. Just relax. No more hassles, okay? I will. Thank you. Alright. Alright. 
Thank you, Doctor. Thank you. someone tells him the truth, sister. We've been working on eggshell all along. What is even all this? Child should be the one at your mercy, not the other way around. Amaka, you are taking things too far. Exactly how things are meant to be, sister. Too far. And you are too cold for my liking. Amaka, you almost kissed someone today. That should be the only thing in your mind. The only thing in my mind is how to get your kidney back. And thank God she did not die. Life goes on. Wow! Oh my goodness! Amaka! Amaka, this is unbelievable! I cannot even recognize my own sister anymore! Amaka! What has happened to you? When did you become this cold? When has your heart become a stone? The very day that monster of a man decided to take your kidney without getting married to you. Sister, people donate kidney to their spouse, no doubt. Not a boyfriend. And if you want to know the kind of man Charles is, ask him to get married to you now or give you back your kidney. Stop it. Okay? Amaka, stop this now. Sister. I am not going to take this from you. No, you will. You actually think that man cares about you? Hell no. He wants that child more than he wants you. How dare you? Who do you think you're talking to? I said stop. Stop. How dare you? It's enough. Don't talk to me like that. You slapped me. You slapped me because I am trying to save you. That's I, I, I'm sorry, Amaka. Come. I, I'm sorry. I, I'm really sorry. I, I didn't mean to hit you. Okay? Amaka, I'm sorry. Talk to me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I am leaving. I am leaving your house. Amaka, 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 come on. Come on, sit us fight. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. Amaka. Amaka, I'm sorry. I want you. I told you everything, but just you never believed me. I'm sorry. But at least I thank God you're fine now. Not just me. Our baby. Yes. You and the baby. Yes. Listen, I promise you, henceforth, nothing will ever happen to you in my house again. Charles, is, is this a promise? Yes, and I mean it. Cross your heart. I cross my heart. And promise to always protect you. I believe you. Thank you. So 
Amaka. Mama. Amaka. Since you came back, you have not been yourself. What is it? Are you okay, Amaka? Are you sick? Ah? Huh? Mama. Is it not Sister Chica? I thought I was helping her. But the thank you she told me was to give me a hot slap. Mama, I have never seen such ingratitude before. Hot slap from Chica. What happened? The pregnant woman that stays with her keeps tormenting her day and night. The only crime Amaka committed was to fight back. Oh, go. Amaka, wait. Amaka, wait. Wait, 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 wait. To fight back. Fight who back? What do you mean by you fight back? I got that wrong. Mama? Huh? What? I said I. Okay, fine. Not like I beat her. Not like I beat her too hard. Just a, 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 small, a small beating and she fainted. Then they rushed her to the hospital. Hey! Chime bomb! Amaka! Amaka! Wait! Amaka, you pushed a pregnant woman. Mama, is that why you shouted like that? Amaka, will you shut up? Amaka! You pushed a pregnant woman. Amaka! Hey! Amaka, you have finished me. Amaka, you have killed me. Yeah, Imugum. Why do you mean? me. Chica. Oh my goodness. Chica can eat brood with Chi 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 pia wishi. Devil in me. Amaka, ya am kai kai. Chela abo. Why do you mean? Ma Mama, wait to. Are you trying to tell me that you support Sister Chica for slapping me? Look at this stupid idiot. Amaka, we are talking about the pregnant woman you pushed down. The pregnant woman that has been tormenting my. Amaka, will you shut that your mouth? Come on, go and get me my phone. Go and get me my phone. Come this way. Come this way. Come, come this way. Hey! How am I going to go about this? What am I going to do? What will I do? Amaka has killed me. Hey! Chimo! You're back. Thank God you're back. Oh my God, baby, uh, baby, baby, how is she? How is everything? Uh, I, I've been trying your number. It, 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 it's not going through. What, what, what's happening? What happened? Is she okay? Is everything okay? Huh? Baby, 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 talk to me. Baby, 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 baby. Baby. Baby, I'm sorry. I'm sorry this happened. But you know it's not my fault. It was unintended. Thank God Benita is fine. And even the baby. Thank God nothing happened to them. But listen, I promise you. This will never happen again. Okay? Believe me and hold me by my words. Okay? It will never happen again. Never ever. Alright? Um, besides, Amaka is no longer here. 
Yes, you heard me. She left. She's gone back to the village. Um, we got into an argument and out of anger I slapped her. And she she moved her bags and and left out of vexation. But hey, that is not even important. What is important here is that I just want you to know that I'm really sorry for what happened and I promise you to never happen again. I cross my heart. Sincerely, to never ever happen again on my honor. Please. When you're done, you pull off the light. Baby. Baby, I'm sorry now. I'm sorry, I mean it. I was so scared. I I thought one city boy has taken you away from me. City boy, ke? Ah, me that went to the city to fight. Fight? With uh -huh. which hand? Is it this one I'm seeing? You think I am joking? I went there to bass bows. You can yeah. fight. <laughs> it's funny. You. Okay, don't fight. Fighting is not good. Okay, so please stop fighting. Or leave, they don't look for my trouble. <laughs> okay. Anyway, when am I coming to see your people? Today. Today? Yes, today. Amaka, I'm serious here. I said today now. Are you serious? Huh? Thing is, both of us agreed to get married, right? Mm -hmm. Either of us can fix the date. Mm. Or do you want me to fix it? I've been thinking. What about weekend? Weekend fine by you? Yes. <sighs> Come here. <laughs> I've missed you. Missed you more. I've missed you so much. I've missed you more. My husband, if not that I called Chica to confirm that the lady is still alive, hey, you would have heard that I died of heart attack. High blood pressure goes woes woes. Amaka did not do well. Oh, Amaka did not do well at all. That is exactly my thought. If Amaka had brought back the corpse of that stupid girl back to this house. I would have known that she's actually my daughter. Huh? Yes. Yes. Hey. Nay. What are you talking about? Wait, wait. I don't understand you. Are you saying that Amanda should sit down and watch another woman humiliate the sister? Or have you not heard that that girl is fully aware that Chica and the child wanted to get married. She went ahead to, to get pregnant for him. Stupid girl. She's wicked. She got what she deserved. So you are supporting Amaka? Ah, no. I should be supporting you. The most problem we have in this family is you. Huh? Because you don't have act like other women. You are not vibrant. You draw you too much. You know how you know, if any man know that the mother-in-law don't take nonsense, they cannot be playing with your daughters. You can know of a chance. Chance will definitely hear from me. He will know the kind of mind I am. I will he, oh, in fact, Okwabona Chas. He 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 the news now. 
Ndi marika minyana hu. Yam de mechas. Em. Na ebiko. Na tabano. Iwe gidi oku da jo. O. Ezi bo di mo ma. Em. Obi ora kod. He told me that he's coming with his people this weekend. That's the better news. That's the better news. My happiness is that let them come. I know my daughter. Amaka will not take any nonsense from any man. I know let them come. We are, we are here. Where are we going? But the Charles. Charles will definitely hear from you. How are you? I don't know you're coming. Eh? How are you and your I'm, work? I'm fine, Mama. I'm fine. Hey. As for hmm? work, I've not, I've not started work yet. <laughs> ha, Mama, so, so good to see you. I didn't expect you. I didn't know you were coming. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. Well, I'm sure you're tired. Long journey. So let me go to the kitchen and get you food, okay? No. No, that is not why I am here, my daughter. Eh. Hmm? I have come here to discuss an important thing with you. Mama, I hope there is no problem. There is no problem. Hmm? No problem. What is going on between you and your husband? My husband? <laughs> Mama, there is nothing going on between us. We are fine. Vero, don't lie to me or pretend to me. You know that I'm your mother-in-law and that also makes me your mother. Mama, I know. You, you don't need to tell me. Of course, you're my second mother. So tell me, why did you not include your husband in your plan? Mama, I, I am lost. Your husband told me that you did not include him in your travel plan, your new job. Travel plan? Mm-hmm. New job. <laughs> Mama, you mean the new job I got in America? <laughs> the one they asked me to come with my family and they are taking care of all the expenses. Yes, my lovely daughter. That is it. Oh, Mama, I didn't know that was what you were talking about. <laughs> I thank God, though. I thank God about it. <sighs> Mama, the thing is when I was asked to fill the form, and everything happened so suddenly and there was nothing I could do at that moment. I had to feel in single because if I had filled it married, there's no certificate to prove that I am a married woman. That is no problem now. You can go to the registrar and just get a date for the court wedding. Court wedding? Yes, it's court wedding. Mama, you talk as if you don't know your son. You know how adamant he's been about this court thing. I've been begging him since. My he said no. Forget about my son. Is he not my son again? Don't worry, just go and get the date. I will sort him out. Hmm? Mama, if I heard you right, you're saying I should go to the registry and get a date exactly for our court wedding. Exactly, my lovely daughter. Mama, you're sure? Yes. That is what you're saying. Exactly, my lovely daughter. Hey, <laughs> Mama. Oh, I like this one. Hey. Thank you so much. Oh, oh, that is why I talk you. about you. See what I've been saying since. <laughs> this is what I've been explaining. I, Mama, I'm happy you said this I know now. that you're a good girl. Mama, a good huh? girl. I don't have problems. It's that just that, that you people don't understand me. I know that you don't have problems at that time. Ah. Mm. Mama, you know what you do for me? Mm -hmm. Just get your son ready. Get him ready for the court wedding. I'll get a date. I'll do that one ASAP. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Mama, Mama, I'm so happy. Eh? I have the hey. best mother-in-law. <laughs> my lovely daughter. Mama. <laughs> Mama, you know what? Let me go into the kitchen and get you something to eat. Ooh. And don't tell me you're not hungry. I'm hungry now. You're hungry, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Mama, 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 welcome, eh? Let me take this bag into your Thank room, you. eh? <laughs> Mama, oh. welcome, eh? Oh. My oh. sweet mother-in-law. Chai, chai. Oh, yo, yo. Mm. I'm so nice. Oh, very nice girl. <laughs> She accepted. Just like that. Yes. Don't you trust your mother again? She was even smiling and... Uh... Smiling? <laughs> Mama, I don't trust that girl. And I don't trust that part where you say she acted like she forgot. Not the Veronica that I know. Mama, even in her dream, Veronica cannot forget her court wedding and her job. I, I have this feeling that she's mocking you. My son, stop talking like that. Have faith. Hmm? She's going to get a date for your court wedding. You say she's cooking. <laughs> I think this girl is playing with us. How did you suddenly change like that? I know who I spoke with. And I know who I am living with. Son, go inside. Go and do your husband duty. Go, go and be a good husband. Go. How was your day? <laughs> Very well. Mm. How are you? I'm fine, my darling. Did you see Mama outside? She came. She's outside. Did you see her? And um, I prepared something great for her. <laughs> yes, I, I, I saw her outside. Oh, okay. Are you okay? Honey, what do you mean am I okay? Do I look sick? No, you don't look sick. Just a question. You worry too much. You know what you do now. Go upstairs, freshen up, and join us at the dining, okay? We're about to eat. So I'll have to include your plate now. Quickly. Baby, what are you still waiting for? Go upstairs. Uh, all right. Okay, guys, let us pray before we eat. Mm -hmm. Honey, yeah. your hands. Okay. <laughs> mm -mm. Young lady, pray for us. Amen. Everyone, bon appétit. Who took my who took my knife? Uh, so you can't even have this. 
No, 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 honey, you're using it. Don't worry, I'll manage. I'll use my hand. You know, I like to eat with my hand. Okay. So, everyone, dig in. <laughs> Don't you trust your mommy? I do. <laughs> Dad, you're not eating. Uh, I, Honey, you're not I eating. Eat. I, I'm kind of filled. I'm, I'm not really hungry. Baby. Yeah. You will like it. Uh, yes, I, I know. Look at your goat meat staring at you. You like good meat? Yes, I. I'm kind of not hungry. Baby, come on. Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> Mama, eat now. Yes, it's so delicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You trust your wife now. I want to appreciate you and uh, specifically thank you for restoring peace and harmony in our family. You are such a wonderful woman. Thank you so much, baby. I know I have made things uh, a little bit difficult for you lately. Let me use this medium to say that I am sorry. Come on, baby. It does not matter, okay? For old things have passed away and all things are new now. Hmm? I'm good, okay? But you have a good heart. Um, Mama said you should um, pick a date for our court marriage. Oh, that. Yeah. I have already picked a date. Wow. Mm -hmm. This Saturday, 12 noon. Wow. Are you serious? Yes, I am. Oh, you're done with the necessary arrangement? Yes, everything. <sighs> what can I do without you? Nothing, baby. Just such Nothing. a darling. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, my sweet husband, you are such a darling. A sweet man. Oh. And that is why I love you. <laughs> I love you too. I love you too, baby. And I like the way you touch me. I know. That's yeah. why I do it. <laughs> <laughs> what an angel. Oh no, you are angel. Ken. Not so, it don't happen. <laughs> not so. <laughs> you feel me? Not so, not so, not so. What you have to tell me, my guy? My wife. My wife has finally accepted to add my name in the list. America, America, here I come. America, my here baby. I come. I'm. <laughs> I'm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is so good. Oh yeah. See, my guy, I've always known that Veronica is a good woman. Yes, she is. Honest, she is. <laughs> but I'm I've always it. also known that my friend is the devil that is bringing all the trouble. Get out. All things are passed away. Behold, I am a new creation. Preach it, preach it. Do you understand? Now, all my friends, oh, all of them, will now know that our levels are no longer the same. Guy, I don't step up. <laughs> I 
they do that level now. <laughs> you feel me? Yeah, I, I don't you. think you speak like America. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah, I feel you. You feel me? I feel you. <laughs> you there? You there? So, me now? Wait, 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 wait. You there? Okay. okay. <laughs> you mean you say, you say your friends? Yes, you mean inclusive? Friend. Of course, including you. <laughs> you know well. Ah. Now my house is a trouble. Ah, shut up. <laughs> now me for say you they go America so. Guy, you know my wife suddenly changed. You know, started doing everything for me. What have me asked me? She will prepare my meals. I would never ask of it. Guy, in the other one, two for seven. She's giving it on the type of me asking of it. Guy, what I go? She just said. You feel me? I feel you. You feel me, right? They, they give you now. Don't tell me. You don't tell me that you know, they give you. Get out. Okay, oh yeah. So play me the whole tape. Our angels of God touched her. You know, <laughs> actually, my mom came around. Okay. Uh, yeah, so, you know, they had one on one talk, woman to woman talk, is that, you know. I was, initially, I was skeptical, you know, until I called her. You know, better places that married people settle their problem. <laughs> I called her there, you know. When I talk, deep down inside of me, I am convinced that she's a changed woman. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. I'm in the spirit. <laughs> you feel me? Okay, you see? You feel me? Bad man. <laughs> Kill you, I feel you. You feel me? I you. You feel me? I feel you. 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 I feel me? Hello. you. feel me? Hello. I feel you. I Son, calm down. Just keep trying. Come on, how, how do you expect me to calm down? How? Just call again. Call again now. <laughs> what do we call this? Still switched off. What is the meaning of this? Huh? What about that, your friend? Man. Yes. Call him and find out whether he has seen or heard from her. Yeah, yeah, T man, have fun. Any good news? Oh, nothing. That phone is still still switched off. Oh, no, 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 don't give up. Oh, yeah. Keep checking. Go about. Check everywhere. You know. It's okay. Tough. Alright, we're waiting. Ah. It's okay, son. Uh, it's Roger. Mm -hmm. oh God. Udubu, Udubu. My in law, I'm happy. I'm so happy that the occasion went very well. Everybody enjoyed themselves. Yes, Thank you very much. I'll bless both of you today. Your union will be fruitful. Yes, you will have male and female children. Yes, and what you will need to take good care of them, you will never lack. Yes, from today, God will bless all your endeavor. Yes, God will guide you. Yes, God will protect you. Yes, Everything good in life will come to you. Yes, <laughs> you. My daughter, stand up. And let's stand up. Uh, Easy. Yes, sir. My in law. Thank you. Uh, Odawroji, as the eldest member of your family, I'm handing my daughter over to you. Please, take good care of her. Oh, my God. 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 O
Today is a wonderful day All the police will also in the life of our family. <laughs> we are very, very happy. Oh my God. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Yes. my in law. We are going to take good care of you. Thank you very much. Thank you. My son here is able yes. and capable. Yes. yes. He's he's capable. capable. Of taking good care. What exactly. are capable? Exactly. We will make her happy. Good. Sure. And we will make sure she lacks nothing. Yes. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. I promise you, my in law, mm -hmm. that the next time you see your daughter, you will not recognize her. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Number not connecting. What could be the problem? So it is now that he wants the court wedding. <laughs> Wait, ah. what is even wrong with this Ken? What is wrong with him? <laughs> they were expecting me to shout and fight. Me. But that's not my style. I was taking it slow and steady. <laughs> I told them yesterday that we're having the court wedding. Just yesterday. That was when uh -uh. I told them. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, I had to dress up the kids to make it look real, to give them hope. <laughs> you did? I did, my darling. My only regret is I was not there to see the disappointment on their faces. <laughs> Vero? Veronica, I cannot even believe this. Mama, you know what? <laughs> In fact, I have come to the conclusion that Vero is a combination of you and Papa. She, she took from you, she took from Papa, me. mixed it together. <laughs> Just imagine what her brain is calculating. Oh. Ah, Vero! Chica, oh, Chica, you will not she understand. You will not daughter, understand. Mama. In marriage, you're not supposed to sit around and expect them to push you around just like that. Sometimes you apply iron fist. Sometimes hey. you... <laughs> Hmm. hmm. Tell me about it. I am telling you, my sister, you don't just sit around and expect anybody to do it for you. You do it yourself, your own way. It's your marriage. It's your marriage, my ah. dear. <laughs> my dear. Uh -huh. ah. I was even going to ask you. What of Charles? What's going on? What's, ah. what's happening between the two of you? My sister, there's no update or nothing new. It's still the same old story. As it is now, we are just waiting for the almighty Benita. To put to bed. That's all. 
Oh, I don't understand. When she puts to bed, what happens? And then we start, you know, taking the marriage steps. But for now, we're waiting for her. She has just put to bed first. <laughs> Hold on a minute. Chica, so after she has put to bed, then Charles will marry you. Um, what if she gives birth to a baby boy and he changes his mind? What will you do? Hmm? You've not thought of that? Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Okay, so what do you expect me to do? What you don't know what to do. do. I'm not going to force him to the altar, am I? Uh, and I'm not going to marry myself as much as I want to get married. I cannot, my hands are tied. Tika, my problem with you is you are not smart. You are not smart where you're supposed to be smart. Tell this young man to marry you before that woman puts to bed. That's what you're supposed to do. And if after getting married, nothing happens, happens is not 100% potent, you guys can opt for IVF. Mm -hmm. IVF. IVF. Mama. Goodness. Veronica. Mm -hmm. How come I never thought about this? Mama, I can actually have my own kids. I can have them through IVF. Of course IVF. you can. Yes. Vero. My goodness. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. In fact, eh, you just rebooted my brains. This is why I am your elder sister to help you think. Because sometimes you don't use this thing. You don't. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. My daughter, please. Please, you have to be very, very careful when approaching him about that. So that you don't bruise his ego. Huh? Mama has a point. Yeah. But most importantly, don't tell him about the IVF until after he has married you. Yeah. Oh, well, we've been trying a natural way now. It has not worked. So, yeah. so he's just to start thinking first. towards that. Don't say it. Mm. <sighs> Chica. I Over have heard you. For yourself, I have heard you. Let him marry you See, first. Then you can start talking about the I IVF. I feel so light. Yes. I know. It feels like an entire body lifted off my shoulders. Goodness, thank you so much. I'm tired already. Talk about what exactly? About the kidney you forcefully collected from her. Papa? Mama? I didn't know you were coming. Let me get you something. Don't bother. I'm not here to stay. I didn't bother telling you I'm coming. After all my warning, you collected my daughter's kidney. Papa, it's, it's not like that. It's not what you think. It's not what I think. I can see. It's not what I think. After collecting my daughter's kidney, you are here with this Akuna Akuna. Eh? Hey, please, sir. With all due respect, don't, don't, don't just start so easy. Well, you shut up your mouth. You shut up your mouth. How dare you talk when I'm talking? The one I'm talking to is a very small. She, she, she don't push her in front of If I give you my letter, you end up in more charity. Look at you. Eh? You know, Charles and my daughter is planning to get married. And you jump in with your gorilla head you, 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 to, to get pregnant. You are not ashamed of yourself. You have, have much to talk. In fact, I'm not here for you. When, when, uh, Charles, I'm here for only one thing. You either marry my daughter or you return her kidney. What? Ah. <laughs> yes, I know now. M -m marry what? What? Uh, Charles cannot marry your daughter because I am already pregnant for him. Will you shut up your mouth? I, I, are you carrying this order? What are you carrying there? How is he even sure that that in your calendar belongs to him? Any woman that can open her life for a man that is a serious relationship can open life for any man out there. Nonsense. I'm not to talk about three more. You are not ashamed. 
Ehu. Charles, please, I cannot sit here and listen to this. Ah, hey, come back. Let, let, let us quarrel. Come and challenge me. Nonsense. Now listen. Listen. I'm not here to joke with you. I'm not here to joke with you. I'm here to tell you only one thing. You either marry my daughter or you return her kidney. Are you hearing me? In fact, in fact, in fact, you don't even have a choice. I changed my mind. You are going to marry her because you are already carrying part of her. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Listen. You have to stay here. Anytime he decides to fix the marriage date, you let me know. Okay, Papa. Don't joke with me. Don't dare me. Idiot. That is not possible. You cannot do it. I mean, how can I be pregnant for you just carrying your child and you want to get married to another lady, another woman? How is that possible? Why would you do it? That is not possible. News flash, Benita. It is going to happen and in your presence. Yes. No, like seriously, I do not even understand it. You're here screaming. You think it is just okay for Charles to marry you with my own kidney? Really? You must be a joke. I was. So that's all you want, right? Let me tell you something. Charles is mine. And he is mine. That is period. Oh, Benita. Stop being delusional. Charles is not yours. For goodness sake, what do you think you are? Why are you overrating yourself? You think this arrangement, this arrangement is a permanent arrangement? I mean, me, you, Charles, under one roof, it is only but temporal. Get that into your, 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 your fixed core. I do not even, wait, wait a minute. Do you even know the intensity of the sacrifice that I made for this same Charles? Do you know what it means for a human being alive to be with an organ of another human being still breathing? Chica. Do you understand it? Chica, just pray that I don't give birth to a boy. Because if I do, huh? Oyo is your case. Enough! Both of you, I've had just enough from you two. I'll have the last laugh. Definitely. Let's watch and see. That will not happen! Baby, you needed to have seen what happened today. The vehicle I entered on my way back home. That's how in the middle of nowhere this vehicle just stopped. Couldn't move again. To crown it all, the stupid driver did not buy fuel in the car. That's how we waited for hours for him to fix the car. After fixing the car, we had to wait for another hour for him to buy fuel and put in the car. <laughs> it was not funny today. Oh. Veronica. Hmm. Baby. That hasn't answered my question. But baby, I... Veronica. What your husband is trying to say is, where have you been since yesterday? Simple. Yesterday. I, I, I went to the village for Amaka's traditional wedding. Amaka? Yes, my the younger sister, our last born. Mama, you know her. Maybe you know my sister, Amaka. Yesterday was our traditional wedding. I would have said introduction, but we did everything together. So why then did you fix your own wedding the same yesterday, since you know you were not going to be around? Mama, there is no way I would have fixed my own wedding for yesterday when my sister is wedding yesterday. Are you now saying that I'm lying? No, Mama. Mama, I told you. I told you that this girl knows what she is doing. Baby, come on. This is just a mix-up. Eh? Probably I was saying something else and Mama understood something else. She didn't understand what I was saying. Mommy! 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 
What is... Oh, you're hungry? Yes. Oh, my babies. You've not eaten today? Yes. Sorry. Baby, let me go and make food for my babies, okay? Before they die of starvation. Hmm? Okay, babies. But how come you've not eaten today? Didn't grandma make something for you? No. She didn't make anything for you? She didn't make anything. Hmm. Hmm. My job must be very hard. Okay. Run to the kitchen. I'm coming. Quickly! We're we'll starting with the juice. While I make the food, okay? Um, baby, sorry. Mama, let me make food for my children, eh? Because these are your starvation. I'm coming. Ken. Was she not the one that dressed these children up yesterday? <laughs> Mama, don't mind her. I know. You see her? Don't mind her! Calm down. Calm down, son. Calm down. You know, this period, you have to follow her with, with sense now, eh? Just calm down, yourself. Don't shout. You have to use wisdom now to follow her, hmm? <laughs> Look, I'm serious, though. I'm really serious. Yes, now. I want to invest in that business. See, like, put in, like, um, like, three million, four million. At least my... You think you've invested? Of course not. Million. Uh -huh, something like that now. Then we know that we are... Honey. <laughs> My baby. <laughs> hey, beautiful woman. Look at her. Eh? Always wearing to match. Give me that beautiful hand, my friend. Mm? Mm, I worship you. I love you so much, my sweet. Uh, where are you going? I'm rushing off to the market to get some of the things you don't have. <laughs> uh, my love, what do you mean, some of the things I don't have? Have you forgotten this is our house? Huh? This house belongs to you and I. So the right statement should be some of the things we don't have. That is it. Uh, moreover, I have told you to get a maid. I will pay the person monthly or even weekly. If the person wants daily, I will pay. I am capable. Mm -hmm. I don't want you to stress yourself, my love. I love you so much. Please. Okay, honey. Um, I'm sorry. It, it was a slip of tongue. And for the maid, no, I don't think I want any maid. Okay, anything you say is right because you are my queen and I love you so much. All right, you driving to the market or you? You know I love you so much. Anything you want to do is fine by me and please drive carefully, all right? You know you're yet to perfect your driving skills. Hmm? Okay. One more important thing, do not make calls while driving, all right? Honey. Please. <laughs> okay, I will. Mean. All right. All right. Uh, please come back quick. Of course. I love you. <coughs> um, okay, Ebuka. Mm -hmm. Please take care of yourself. Look at her. Okay. Bebe. Bye -bye. Hey, my long life and prosperity. Oh. Drive carefully. Love <laughs> boy. My long life and prosperity. Love boy. <laughs> last, last. This uh, your woman, a full package. She's beautiful. Natural beauty. <laughs> Everything complete. Mm. I told you, right? I told you that she's my life. Mm? You see, when a man sees his last bus stop, he knows. The very first day I set eyes on Amaka, I knew she's my wife. I knew she's my last bus stop. Mm. Ah. Everything did there. Do you see? Do you see? It's all, it's all, it's I understand. Uh -huh. See, see, see. I hope you are holding your ground very well. No, I, I know what I'm talking about. So those boys, they don't go chop your woman. Hey, Buka, where is this one you come from now? I they tell you what in day. What are you telling me? You know me too well now. <laughs> Nothing happened to me now. You know, I don't share. Eh? So that is, just forget about it. It can never work. It is not possible. Just, just please, just change topic. Okay? I understand. Forget about it. I will change topic, but I know what I'm saying. No, on a more serious note, I know what I'm saying. Eh? Hey, what the fuck are you talking about? What are you talking? Are you? You don't know me. Please just change the topic, all right? Please, yeah, enough. Let's talk about uh, something else. You don't devise us now. I said enough. Uh, my brother, calm down it's now. Okay. It's okay. Let me just stop. Let's change the topic. Let's talk about something else. And please, don't say that nonsense. I know you are short-tempered. I know. Eh? Don't go first like this. Don't go beat that woman one day. You are blood to the heart. Hey, I said just stop it, please. Change topic. Stop. Let's go. 
So, what exactly is the problem? Huh? Well, now the alternator, the alternator don't spoil, and the battery safe, don't spoil. So to change alternator? Hmm. But you were the one that changed this battery the last time. Uh, yes, it don't pass six months now, madam. It don't pass six months. Uh, I've been safe one year. Uh, oh. You suppose don't die now, you don't try. You suppose don't die. So you will change the alternator yes. and the battery? Yes. Alright, yes. get it done. My husband will make the transfer to you. Over. Over. I forgot to ask Not how I got over, there now. Oh. Not over. The, the other mechanic that did this one told me that this battery is original. So if you do your own and it's not original, I'll come and catch you. Madam, no worry yourself. Oh. No worry yourself. Make a guy just call me. No worry yourself. Hello, honey. Yeah, the... The mechanic said it's alternator and battery. Yes. Exactly the same thing I told him and he said the battery has lasted longer than it should. Yes. He's on it. Yeah, I told him to get it done that you send the money to him. Okay, honey, please, can you send OK to come pick me up? No, I don't want to take a taxi. All right. I will send you the address. Yeah, but I'll be in a restaurant waiting. <laughs> Love you too, honey. Okay, all right. Love you. Thank you. So like I said, my husband will attend to you. Okay, okay. Please get it done. Okay, okay. And when you are done, you have his number. Hey, beautiful. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Are you expecting anyone? No. That makes me a lucky man then. What did you win? I just won you. Please, can I have your number? I have mine. Do you have a man? You mean you have a responsible man that allows you to drive a 40 car, keeps you on the road? Excuse you? Yes, I, I saw you. I saw you with a man that looks like a mechanic. Please. Give me your number. I said no. I thought we were friends already. Like. Okay. Okay. Alright. So, um, I hope we see some other time. Are you looking for something? 
Yes, my second form. Why are you looking at me like that? Wait, wait. You think I stole your phone? Um, okay. Please, can I use your phone to, to dial my line? Uh, there's no end time in this one. Are you being serious right now? I can't find it. I'm not joking. To see at me, my husband will understand everything. Okay. So? Thank you. It's not, not going. I don't know. I'll find it anyhow. That's fine. That's fine. Um, I'll look for it. It's not connected. I thought I'd asked you to stop calling me. When are you going to give up? Please don't call me again. I am very busy. I beg of you. Very stupid. My friend, will you stand up when I'm talking to you? Stand up! Have you lost it? Who raised you up? Am I lying? Are you calling me a liar now? Huh? I don't know what I saw in there. My room is so unkept. Why? And I'm very sure you didn't prepare my food. Honey, I prepared your meal. You prepared my meal? Huh? All you know how to do is to sit, drink, watch stupid TV. You saw me walking into my room. You can't even follow up. I have to come and bow down to you. Her royal highness. I should bow down to you for you to give me my own food. The food you prepared with my own money. I should beg you first. Is that so? Are you, are you sure you're okay? You're very stupid, you mad. How dare you talk to me like that? How dare you talk to me in that manner? What is wrong with you? Are you crazy? How dare you slap me like that? Am I your slave?
Amaka, keep running. All right? Keep running. From there and go back to your village. Because if you come back to this house, I swear to God, Amaka, I will kill you. You touch me. You touch the lord of this house. Just run from there. All right? Disappear. Because coming back here, prepare for your barrier. If I see you here, your parents should prepare for your barrier. Hey, beautiful. Why, why would I stop calling your number? I mean, it's, it's, that's a difficult thing to do, you know. Because you have a man, because you have a husband. On you? Nah, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Come on. <laughs> hey, man please don't call her back. She's busy. <laughs> mm. Can you come get me? Yeah. Okay, um, secretariat. By I'm opposite second. No, in front of secretariat. Yes. Okay, I'm waiting. Thank you. 
she never see anything. She's full of herself. I no no go. We be the same. I'm a panic fan. I'm a bogey lola malu. What the fuck can I say? What is it? I'm a what the hot show is real. Well, you know you give up. That I got the budget, but now I'm on the road. What happened? What are you doing here? Please, can you just take me out of here? But who did this to you? I don't want to talk about it. Can you just take me out of here? Oh, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. Oh no, this is not nice. Please come, come. Sorry. <laughs> Um, welcome to my place. Please feel free to um, take my place as your place. I don't bite, uh, kill, or destroy. Seems you read the Bible a lot. I think you're the only one here. <sighs> First of all, I want to apologize for inconveniencing you. No, 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 you don't have to. You don't have to. I'm fine. You, you know I don't know anyone in the city. If you hadn't taken my call, maybe... Left on the street. It's okay. Please dry your tears. You don't have to do this. Okay, I, I, I'm here. And um, sorry that your useless husband has to beat you up and throw you to the street. You know, going to wait for you back at home with a cane. Sorry. I don't know how some men are able to do do a thing like that. No woman deserves this. No woman. Okay, but trust me. I will help you come out of this terrible experience. Trust me. Um, so, please, just uh, relax, yeah? Okay. So, uh, we play a game. Let's, let's play a game. But before then, what would you like to eat? Well, I am not hungry yet. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. That's the more reason why we should play a game. You're insisting. Yes. Okay. So it's called truth or dare. Truth or dare? Yes, <laughs> truth or dare. I mean, it's not a very difficult game. I mean, it's something I you should know. Okay. All right. It's a game for a moment like this. So this is just to ease you off. All right. So, truth or dare? Dare. Okay. I dare you to eat rice with me or kiss me. A what? Okay. I'll eat rice with you. Rice? Uh, yes, rice. Good. Rice there. 
Why that? <laughs> so I just need you to be fine. But I'm okay. Don't get rice. For the meal. It's a yummy meal. I I enjoyed it. Thank you. Yeah. Ah, so back to our game. I, I thought we were actually done with that. No, darling. We just got started. See. Uh, I I dare you to kiss me. Are you insane? <laughs> How can you possibly ask me to do that? Come on, T. Come to think of it. How come you're the only one asking? It's my turn. Ask. Truth or dare? Okay, tell me a secret that only you know. No lies. I am madly in love with you. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Back to my turn. A kiss or a blowjob? Are you still asking me to do that? Um, you're not opting out, remember? I, of course, I, I don't want to opt out, but if... I'm waiting. Come on, see, that's quite harsh. your eyes. I'm waiting. Okay. Come close. I I said come close and you're coming close. Yes. <laughs> okay. and my wife is not back. What is going on? This has never happened before. 
She's not even taking her course. She's not even taking her course. I'm finished. I am finished. What am I going to do? Huh? Please. Maka, pick up. Pick up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. Ah. Ah. Hey. Pick up, please. I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. Pick up. I'm sorry. Hey, she's not even picking up. Uh. Finished. I am finished. Okay. Hello. Hello, my love. Baby. Baby, I'm sorry. Please. Uh, it was the devil. Oh. I'm sorry. You didn't sleep at home last night. Where are you? Do you really care too much? I, I care about you. You know I love you so much. Please, it was a mistake now. Eh? It was a mistake. Come back home. Let us settle this amicably. Please, I'm sorry. I will never hit you again, my love. Biko, sugar. I don't want to. I don't want to come home. You're just going to kill me. I don't want to. My love, don't even say that. Please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It was the devil. I will never hit you again. Pikonu, sweetheart, I will not do it again now. Listen to me. Come back. We can settle this amicably now. Where are you? Where are you? Hello? Hey! I'm finished. I'm finished. Hey! What have I done to myself? What have I done to myself? Huh? What have I done to myself? Obiora, you are stupid. You are very stupid. Obiora, you are a fool. Obiora, you are, you are useless. You are very stupid. When will you stop all this unnecessary anger and stupidity? When will you stop it? Now my wife is not at home. Huh? I caused it. Why must I hit her every time? Why? What is wrong with me? Obiora, what is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? What if something bad happened to her? Eh? What if... So, what would I tell her people? Because of my stupidity. Now she's not even taking her course. Eh? She's not replying my messages. Where is she? Oh God, please. God, please help me. Help me. You know, I love this girl so much. Please. Let nothing happen to her. Let her come back home. I will never hit her again. This is the last time. If I ever hit her again, Chuku, do anything to me. I will not hit her again, Biko. Please, God, answer my prayers. Bring my wife back. Bring my wife back. Oh, Lord, forgive me. Oh, you're right, stupid. Please forgive me. It was the handwork of the devil. Please. I'm so sorry, my love. I will never hit you again. Please. Forgive me. I'm so sorry, my love, hitting you. It, it wasn't intentional. Please. Find a place in your heart to forgive me. I promise you it will never happen again. I'm sorry. Why will I hit my own woman? Why will I even hit my wife? 
the woman I married. I'm sorry. Forgive me. It will never ever happen again, I promise you. I will not hit you again. I'm sorry for making you go through this stress. I'm sorry. I love you. I love you so much. Sorry for hitting you. But honestly, I'm not like this. Hmm? I don't know what happened. I don't know what came over me for me to hit my beautiful woman like this. Look at you. My love, it will never happen again. It's a promise. I will never raise my hands on you again. Never. I cross my heart and I'm making this vow to you today, here and now. I will never hit you again. The very day I hit you again, heaven bear me witness. You can do whatever you want to do with me. Or stop seeing me like your husband. I'm sorry. It's hmm? okay. I am fine. In no time, eh? Not this bruises. The pains, they will go away. Alright, I know what to do. I will take you to the hospital and they will they will take care of you. <laughs> but I said I am fine, my love. I I'm okay. Are you sure you're fine? <laughs> oh, is someone missing my my touches? Come on. <laughs> I am fine. Alright. So cheer up. Huh? Okay. Cheer up. Listen, the event planner called me. He's ready. Everything is ready for our wedding next week. <laughs> That's nice. Very nice. Baby, you know, I cannot wait for our white wedding to come and go. You know I love you so much. Hmm? I know. I cherish you. <laughs> I love you. My joy. Sorry, it's the pain in you. Mm, not that much. Sorry, sorry. Sorry. Okay, um, honey, excuse me. All right. Babe. Babe. You still angry, right? I'm sorry. My long life and prosperity. Whew. Next week. Baby! Your phone is ringing. Babe, your phone is ringing. Babe! Your phone is ringing. <laughs> you, where, where are you going to this place? Eh? Why don't you check the other side? Why? Why not? No, you check the other side. Come but on. we've checked that already now. Babe, Honey, stop. Can you please go to the next place? Please leave this folder. It's alone. because you're not looking handsome here. That's why you don't want us to look handsome. Trouble. Okay, okay. Let's let's leave this one. Can we just go to the next folder already, please? Which folder again? But meanwhile, honey, when is the main album coming out? Me, I don't like what you're doing. Uh, it will be out in, in a month time. That is what the the photographer told me. 
the show. Hurry up. I just can't wait to hang something here. Yeah? Hang something there that's my picture. Man, look at our lovely pictures. <laughs> Who would believe it's one month already? Why do you keep going on and on about this one? This very one that you're looking too handsome. But honey, come to think of it. You know, I've been wondering how time flies. Like, I remember how, uh, uh, how you've been following me about all this one. Mm -hmm. Be my love, I want to marry you. This is one, and I was just doing shagara like Tolo Tolo. <laughs> and now you are with me, have you? Yeah, it's more Listen, I want to make a promise to you. I know I've said this countless times, but I will say it over and over again. Okay. I will love you forever. And I will spend the rest of my life with you. Forever. And I will love you forever and I will spend the rest of my life with you. <laughs> you glad in my heart. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What yeah. was that? I am perceiving something. My. You cooking? Yeah, my meat. Oh, babe, come oh, on. I'm sorry, I'll be right back. We always... Fuck, man, this... Please be careful next time, eh? Oh, this picture is nice. Yeah. Hello? Who is this? How dare you call my wife your sugar baby? Who the hell are you? It's not a wrong number. Who are you? Who are you calling your sugar baby? Hello? Who the hell is this man? Have you, have you checked it? Yes, yes. Yeah, so everything is okay now, right? It's almost worse, almost worse. Okay. Not. So yeah, when, that's good. when, when you stop? Um, babe, excuse me. No. Honey, your, your, your food is almost done. I said, excuse me. My phone, I don't know. Did you by any chance see it? No, I, I didn't see it. Let's go check it inside. Okay, um, honey, are you okay? Let's go inside. Okay, let's hey. go. 
after you. Please. been eating your food. Are you okay? No. What is it? Can you tell me what bothers you? Please. Can you talk to me? I am your wife. You can confide in me. Hello. What? Honey, say something. How long what? How long have you been sleeping with Sima? <coughs> Okay. You just said stupid for 
Toto. Veronica, what is the problem with you? For the past five months, you've been tormenting me. Why are you this cruel? No, Ken. Rather, why are you suddenly interested in this court wedding? That should be the question. Because I've been begging you for over how many years to wed me in the court. You refused. All of a sudden, you are interested in it. So why? That should be the question. Hold on a minute. Ken. So you want to kill me and take over my visa? No, 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 no. This is what this is all about. You want to kill me and take over my visa. No, this, this, this is what you're, you're about to do, right? Hello, did I hear you well? You heard me. Have you lost it? No, 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 no. I'm Are you lost. mad? Kill you? Mm -hmm. Take over your visa? Yes. For what? Oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. Have you been pretending all along? No, but jokes apart, Ken. Let me ask you a question. Were you thinking I was going to include you in my travel plans? I said it! I knew it! I told my mother all along that you were only playing us, but she never believed me. So, for the past five years I've been waiting for you, I've been waiting for you in vain. When I was busy telling all my friends that very soon, I am going to leave this country. Oh, Veronica. Ken, did you say the past five months? You had me well. You've been waiting for me for the past five months. Of course. Do you know how many years I waited for you? Do you know how many years I begged you? Ken, nine years. Nine good years of pain, insults, disrespect from you, from your mother. Did you do it for me? No. And now, just five months, and you're comparing it with my nine years of pain, disrespect, and insults. Really? Come on, Ken. Come on. Veronica, you are <laughs> evil. Veronica, you are not just evil, but Veronica, you can kill a man, perish a man, and nobody will know about it. Oh, you didn't know? Come on, honey. I thought you were a good judge of character. I've been living with you for nine good years, and you don't know your wife. Darling, I am the devil himself. I am demon. I am evil personified. And please, where's your phone? Pick up your phone. Call your mom because you always report everything to her. Call her. Tell her your wife is about to kill you because I will kill you. Ken, I will kill you. And do not forget to tell her when I am done killing you. She's next. Veronica. Veronica! Hey, hey, don't shout my name like that. But she's not even ready to help out. She has been playing. She's been playing with us all along. Never.
Hello. Look how fast. Mr. Charles. Yes. How's my wife? Congratulations. It's a boy. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Can I see her now? Oh, of course. You can go ahead. Let me do something in the house. <laughs> my God. Yeah, it's nice. Well done. Baby, it's a boy. Jesus, it's a boy. God has given me a boy from my wonderful husband. Let the world know it's a boy. It's a boy. <laughs> a boy, before boy. It's a 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 boy. B for boy. It's a boy. Oh, my waist too. What is this? Mama, call your daughter. 
Mama, call your daughter. Oh. Hey, your ma. eh? Call my daughter. Mama, call your daughter. Which of my daughter? Hey. What happened? Mm. Mama, call her. Mama, call her. Mama, Mama call her. Mama, call her. Mama, call her. Speak to me now. What is going on? Talk to me. Wait. Wait, let me calm down small, Mama. Wait. Hey, your ma, speak. Oh, Mama. Mm. Okay, see here. Eh? I can't really explain this thing now, eh? But Amaka said that if you want her life, that you should come and take her to the hospital. <laughs> I don't know. Take her to the hospital? Yes, Mama. But I'm in the village. Mama, what Mama. about her husband? Oh. Mama, I don't know. No, so she said. all is not well at all. Something is going wrong. Mama. What will I do? Where is my phone? Mama. Where is my phone? Mama, call, Mama, call. Wait, I'm coming. Dying. Ah, Mama, she was very okay when I left the house. Uh, but all the same, I'm at home now. I will just go and check on her. Uh, Mama, nothing seriously. Probably she's missing you. Uh, yes, I will check on her. I just got to the house now. All right, I will, I will call you once I'm with her. Of course. Uh, Mama, how are you and the family? Okay, I'm missing you. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you soon. Eh? Let me talk to her. Alright, take care. Amaka! 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 What gave you the infantry? What gave you the temerity? Eh? What gave you the moral to call your mother and report me to her? Am I not talking to you? Bastard! Vera, please take me to the hospital. I should take you to the hospital? Yes. To do what? Now you listen to me. I'm about to call your mother right now. God help you, you say rubbish to her. I will deal with you drastically. You know me too well, right? I'm about to call her right now. So comport yourself. Behave yourself. Do not say anything nonsense to her about me. I'm understood. <laughs> hey, stop all those nonsense <laughs> you're doing now. I will just slap you to death. Animal. Pretender. Hey, stop. Stop it. Shh. It's ringing. Behave yourself. Hello, Mama. Yes, I'm with your daughter right now, my beautiful wife. Let me give her the phone so you can speak with her. All right, Mama. Hello? Amaka, Ijoma told me that you are not feeling fine. What is it? Eh? Hello? Amaka, are you there? Are you hearing me? Mama, I am fine. Amaka? Uh, Amaka, but your voice. Your voice is not sounding fine. Mama, I am fine. I am just waking up from sleep. And I am having a little fever. Fever? Amaka, how serious is it? Eh? Mama, I, I, I feel weak and I wake up late these days. Eh? Ah. <laughs> I understand, my daughter. Eh? It's a good fever. But just go to the hospital so that the doctor will confirm it for us. Oh? In Anunne? Eh? Oh, just do that. Mama? Um, my in-law. 
<laughs> I guess you guys have finished talking. Oh, I told you that she's fine. Yes, yeah, she's very fine. Just, yes, yes. She's very okay. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you. Ungwan. Okay, Mama. Take good care of yourself, okay? We love you. Yes, so much. Hey, Mama. What kind of news did you come with? You almost gave me heart attack. But Amaka is fine. Mama. Mm? Mama, I don't think so. Mama, the voice I heard over the phone mm. was that of a half dead woman. God forbid. Mama, didn't you see the way I was running? Not my daughter. Okay, see, Mama M. Mm. I still feel you should go to the city and see her. Go to the city and see her? Yes, Mama. When her darling husband is there. Oh. He's there with her. Okay, so why did she call me? <laughs> my daughter, I think she's pregnant. Mm. She's pregnant. <laughs> mba, mba, mama. Uh, mama, no. Uh, mama, the Amaka that called me on phone doesn't sound sick to me. But in pain. Okay, how come her husband came back and she began to sound fine? Oh, my daughter. Yes, ma'am. I've heard you. Oh, uh, let me give her some time. After next tomorrow, and she still sound the same, I'll go to the city and see her. Oh? Mm, okay, mama. No problem now. I just pray that my friend is fine. Though. Uh -huh. I don't want anything to happen to my friend. Nothing mama. will happen to her. My daughter is fine. She's fine, oh? Okay, mama. Yeah, she's fine. Oh? Okay, now, mama. Um, I have to go back to what I was doing before she called now. Okay, eh? my dear. Oh, yeah. I am now, mama. Oh, God, mama. Okay, ma. Take care of yourself. your mother for me, only. All right, ma. Take care of yourself, oh? oh okay, I ma. Uh, one. You reported me to your mother. <laughs> huh? Did you tell her that you cheated on me? Did you tell her that you cheated on me? You cheat! Did you tell her that? Report card! Talk to me, my friend! I did not report you to each other. I only thought that, that my mother to come and take me to the hospital. Oh, you think you're the only one that needs to go to the hospital, right? Huh? You want to go to the hospital? Righteous queen! Idiot! You don't know what I'm thinking? Because of you, you cheated on me. And you're here telling me you want to go to the hospital. You're crying. Because you don't see tears on my face. You think I'm okay? You think I'm okay? Huh? You think I'm okay after cheating on me? Nonsense. Don't you know I need to be admitted as well? I need to see a therapist. You think I'm okay like this? You don't know what is going through my mind. I am dead. My mental health is not okay. You don't want to make me go to all because you think I'm not crying. You think I'm fine. Because you don't see tears on my face. Animal, you're not going to anywhere. You hear me? You are not going to anywhere. Ogara, oh please. Take me to my parents. Don't kill me. Repeat it again. I should take it to your what? I should take it to your parents. Eh? You must be sick. After everything I've spent on you. After I've lavished money on you. Now you want to go to your parents. Animal, no. Never. You're not going anywhere. You remain here with me forever. I will never divorce you. You see this marriage? We stay here. We die here together. For better or for worse, we are in this marriage together. Am I understood? Huh? Now get up. Get up. Inside. Get up, my friend. You want me to force you? Get up. Get up. You're forming your sick. Get up. Get up. I will slap the hell out of you now. It's okay. Nothing is wrong with her. She's okay. I heard her voice. She's sounding fine. Charles, the baby is here now. She's put to bed. It's time to let her go. Are you alright? Of course I'm alright. I am alright. It's time to let her go. Why are you still keeping her? Why are you holding on to her? No, tell me. Or is there still any reason you're holding on to her? No, 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 tell me! My father gave us time. We asked for time. We asked him for time and he gave. Months after, nothing is happening. Why are you trying so hard to hold on to her? Why? The baby is here. Why is she still here? But that woman just gave birth three days ago. And now you want me to take the child and send her out? God, where is your conscience? My conscience? Yes. Charles, where is your own conscience? I should be the one asking you that. Do you even have one? Do you have a heart? 
Why are you treating me like this? Why? You seem to be having so much fun with everything going on. You have nothing to lose. Look at you. You have your life. You have a child. What about me? I have nothing. Nothing. You have me. You? Yes. How? You have me. Or do you think I'm enjoying all of this going on here? <sighs> okay then. What are you going to do? How do you intend to fix this? Since you're not enjoying it. Tell me. Darling, if wishes were horses, I swear to God I'll do whatever you want. Right now. But my hands are tight. Oh, really? Really, Charles? Charles, I sacrificed for you. I almost gave up my life for you. In fact, my life is conditioned forever because of you. I know. Charles, I cannot even drink alcohol because of the sacrifice I made for you. So many things I cannot do anymore. And this is just... A whiny tiny little thing you can do to fix us and you're refusing to do it Charles this is too little a sacrifice for you to make tell me what is so difficult in this babe it's not as easy as you think it's not okay then fine I think I have a solution let's kill her what? You heard me. We kill her. We keep the baby. We have the baby. It's a win for you and I. Everyone is happy. Oh, Spit out of your mouth. If this is not you. Hey, hey, hey. You have to put yourself together. Alright? Put yourself together. Don't let this turn you into something you're not. You're not a monster. Come, come. It's getting to me. Come, come. It's getting to me. The baby. The baby. What's going on? Babe. My lovely wife. Love you. It was the devil. The devil made me do this to you. I'm so sorry. It won't happen again. I mean, look at you. Huh? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It will never happen again. Please. Uh, sorry. How are you? Can I at least have my phone so I can speak to my parents? My love, I, I just apologize to you. Please, forgive me. It will never happen again. Alright? We don't need a third party in our marriage. We don't need an outsider, okay? We need to be together. My parents are not outsiders. You got it all wrong, my love. This is marriage you're talking about. It's not. A relationship okay anybody aside you and I is an outsider please whenever we have a problem or issue let's try and settle it amicably among ourselves I love you so much I'm sorry promise me that you will never hit me again I swear to God who made me. I swear to God, I cross my heart.
I will never, ever again in my life hit you. I... I love you very much too. I love you more. And I am very sorry. You don't have to. Just forgive me. It's okay. It's okay. It's just that it happened before that. Hey, hey! What is it? Huh? What is wrong with you? I'm just talking to you. We're having a good time. Why? Why will you bring this in this our conversation now? Huh? Honey, I thought. We I said enough. No sense. I was having a good time with you. I just break. Don't, don't ever, don't ever in your life again say that nonsense again. Okay. to myself into So, that is the tradition. Now, since her father is late and I, as uh, one of her late father's uh, kinsmen, I will make sure we help her to make a right decision. Hmm? Except you don't want the child. Though. But Mazi, I just explained my situation to you. Huh? But don't you understand me? Your situation is not for you to understand. Uh -huh. Not for me to understand anything. Uh -huh. I did not create the tradition. If you got this tradition, it has been there since we go. Eh? Old, old, old tradition, even before I was born. Then you cannot have that child except you marry her. Mm -hmm. eh? That is tradition. Mm. <coughs> um, Mazi Uzo, hmm? please, I have something to say. Gwano, I'm listening. Between you and your God, are you trying to say that if I were your daughter, you will sit here and advise Charles to marry her because of one stupid tradition. Mm, will no, you do that? Mm, tradition is not stupid though. Hey. Mazi. Mm? Mazi. Mm? Everybody seems to have forgotten that. The only reason Charles here is alive and we are having this conversation is because I, Chica, gave him one of my kidneys. I sacrificed one of my kidneys to keep this man here alive. And that's the only reason we're sitting here having this conversation. If he was dead, we would not be here. I made sacrifices. Chica, do you know stupidity is just the only problem you have? Yes. Mm. Stupidity, that's the only problem that you have. What is it? You forgot that Charles has money and he can actually pay you for that kidney. What is it? I don't even know what you're waiting for. Pay her for the kidney now. Interesting. Then I think we can reach a common ground, Benita. Since we're talking about payment and settlement, Benita, you are not the first and you will not be the last to be pregnant for a man. Mm. <laughs> Thank God for surrogacy. Surrogacy is no longer news in our society today. As a matter of fact, Africans have embraced it. Surrogacy is a process where Couples looking for children can pay a mother to carry their babies for them. And Benita, you are nothing different from a surrogate mom. That is what you are. An incubator for our baby. Your mother will think that I will leave Charles for you. I will not do that. How dare you? not will not happen. How dare you? It will not happen. Chica, it will not happen. Benita, your kidney will never be a mine. Kidney that can be bought. Your kidney can be bought. Kidney that can be bought. Kidney that can be bought. I will not leave it for you. I will not leave it for you. Kidney can be bought. I will not leave it for you. We will pay you for that kidney. You are not yes, it can be bought. I will try my kidney. I am not a surrogate. I am not. I am not. It is a baby. I will not leave it for you. Yeah. Your generation has a lot of problems. Oh yes. My own time. 
Oh yeah. You would have married both of them without any qualms. Who who will question you? Oh, quite really well. They 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 both your wife. You go go man. You know you do not want. I don't understand though. Now, what do you advise me to do at this point? I need to know what do you advise me to do. Mm. Jane, I will advise you, like a fellow man, plead with both of them, so that you can marry both of them. You have peace of mind. What? Yes. Nah, 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 nah. This advice is a no-no for me. It's not going to work here. Trust me. Mm. Yes. Tell me something else, please. Odima. Okay. Look at both of them. Look straight into their eyes and see the one that loves you so much. Stick with her. The other one, pay her off. Okwebe. I think this can work. Yeah, this can work. But you have to be very fast too before they burn down this whole house, this beautiful house. Of, of course, of course, yes. But I, I doubt. I doubt. Even if you want to marry them, they can't live in peace. Just take that advice. Hmm? Okay. Yes, yes, I'll do just that. I'll do just that, Uncle. No, uh, I want. I want to start going because the road is far. Mm -hmm. uh, is there anything? <laughs> Your mom will put in his pocket. <laughs> I will look at transfer. <laughs> it's all right, I understand. Let me just go upstairs, get something ready for you. Okay? Yes, and you could call my daughter for me. Say it's all right, I'll do just that. Hello? All right. Mm. No, yes, yes, seriously. You have not seen anything. You have not seen anything. You have not seen anything. You yeah, enough for Benita. Enough for Benita. Who has turned you to a mad woman? Be cool. What give me? Nay, nay. You don't know what I'm passing through in this house. You don't know. Whatever it is, eh? Ada, hey, this young man is very rich. Eh? Act smart. Instead of you looking for a way to collect huge amount of money from him. You are here struggling, looking for position. Who, who has position helped in this world? Eh? Listen to me. If you are not careful, if you are not careful, these two people will abandon you with your child and run out of the country. Oh yes! I see. <laughs> oh yes! If we see in Egypt, that way is not possible. Something I want to tell you. What is it? Charles is important. We can You see, hmm? that child is his only hope. That lady cannot give it to him. That why? That why? Eh, but all the same, eh, you have to be very wise. Hmm? You, you act must be very smart. Hmm? Look, take a decision now. Eh? Cajole him. Collect money. Have a lot of money in your account. In your account. Eh? You give me my own. I put it there. And everything is going on like that. <laughs> it's alright. Uh, and one more thing. One more thing. Benny. Biko. I don't like this. Your constant fight with that woman. Enough is enough. Otherwise, they will, they, will, they will call you a nuisance. Or no, the home man. Okay. Hmm? Then, uh, let me start going. The road is far. Kuma, the road to the village is far. <laughs> he, he promised to get me something. <laughs> huh? They see money, they start misbehaving. Can you imagine? Imagine Benita. Oh. Benita, you see huge amount of money. Let this man pay you off. Isimba. In Adokwa. Fighting for position. Jakadani. Who has position helped? Tell me. Hmm? 
At least, Benita, if you collect this money, small way enter my pocket, then my children can continue with their education. It's a mumba. Hey! Abu Lord go my lekwe to fear. I pray. I just pray that she collects the money. Chuko Kiki Abiyama, please let her have a change of heart. Let her collect that money so that I also the way we go now, and they move them on. When you bring one money, we shall all be happy. Chilikwe, yeah, hey. This whole place is deserted. Oh, can't see you. Hey, Uzo, he talk real. I am fine, mommy. No, you worry too much. <laughs> My darling. What? Um, let me call you back. Are you are you mad? Are you stupid? So I'm not forgiving you. You are still talking to that fool, right? You no, are still talking to that fool. No, I will not. Obvious that you want to die in my hands. You want to die in this house. Who are you talking to? Who? You are talking to another fool again in my house. I'm not forgiving you. Are you crazy? Are you crazy? Are you mad? What have you? I see this idiot sources. You never told me it was your mother. I mean, you know I'm too jealous. Huh? I'm sorry, please. Forgive me. Forgive me. I'm sorry. It won't happen again. I thought you were talking to that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? Look at me. My love. Look at me. I'm sorry. Please. Please, look at me, baby. Look at me. I'm sorry. Huh? I love you. I love you so much, right? You know that. You know what? You know what to do. Right? Just go inside, huh? Freshen up. Do not stress yourself anymore. Just sleep. Enjoy yourself. When I'm coming back, I will get you something nice. I promise you. I will get you something very nice. Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? Please forgive me. What was I thinking, huh? What was I thinking? I'm sorry. It's my fault. I'm sorry. I have to go now. Huh? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's for it. But I'm sorry. Huh? I'm sorry. I'm coming back, babe. Sorry. I see myself hitting her every now and then. Because that is the only way I can take my revenge. My brother, I don't think that is the best. Hmm? Instead of all this, why not divorce her? I think that is the best. Yeah. Divorce? Yes. Far from it. I cannot divorce her. I mean, I love her so much. Yeah. I love her with everything in me. I understand how you feel, but this beating of a thing, I don't want you to beat her to death. I mean, to kill her one day. Beating does not kill a woman, Ebuka. It only resets a woman's brain to factory fitting. I know what I'm doing. I understand you are the man here. And I know you want to take charge. 
But in as much as you want to take charge, I want you to take precautions so you don't beat her to death. I'm your friend. Obiora. Obiora, are you listening to me? What is it? Ebuka, that man sitting over there looks exactly like the man that slept with my wife. Obiora, you are not sure of what you are saying. Okay? Let that man be. Please. Listen, I know what I'm talking about. You know, I I chatted him with my wife's phone. The picture on his profile is the exact person I'm seeing here. I mean, look at his beard. The hair. I'm very sure that man. Say, listen, can you listen to me? I don't want you to create a scene here. You don't have a proof of what you are saying. Please. Let go of me. We are here to drink. Why are you acting like a weakling? I know what I'm talking about. See, that man there looks like... The man has left. I understand, but you have to let go. Please. Let go. What do you mean, let go? If I confirm this man is the same person I'm thinking. I beg you in the name of God. Let not create a scent here. Well, you're my man, right? So if I tell you something, don't you believe me? I understand you, but you don't have a proof. This guy I'm trying, I saw the, the picture, everything is something. You kept me here for three hours? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Three yeah. hours. Uh, now, three hours, three bottles. Uh, uh, I'll make it five bottles. Five bottles? Five bottles. Okay, go and come back after five hours. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you're not drunk. No, right? no, no. Uh, but on one bottle. Uh, Are you now joining my, uh, my enemies to say I'm a drunk? Uh, look at what you. kept you? <laughs> Amira! Get it! <laughs> How are you? I'm good. I just saw you now and I was telling my friend that this is my... My big in-law. What are you doing here? I, I, I'm my friend, you know. I just came to have a good time. Yeah. Yes. What about you? What are you doing here? I came to see my very good friend. Are you serious? Yeah. Hi, back with you. Look at you. You're looking. He <laughs> look good. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. He look good. Thank you. Uh, uh, sorry. Oh, G. Yes. Me too. I'm Obiora. Oh, okay. My Hi. Obiora. As a matter of fact, he got married to my wife's younger sister. Oh, really? Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. Thank, you. Thank you. Now let me remain now. You <laughs> have to go and get married, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Obiora. Yes. Me too. I'm Tony. Oh, Tony, yes. my bosom friend. Yeah? But we simply call him T Man. Oh, yes. <laughs> so, hope you're my good uh, in law. <laughs> you know him? I never met him. Of course, you know your celebrity. Oh, of course. <laughs> you are the T Man. Yeah, T Man. When you're around with that. T Man. The guy that slept with my wife. <laughs> Honey again. Do not ever call me that honey again. How did I even end up with you? Eh? How? I left all the beautiful girls in the city and I went straight to that cost village to look for you. Your mother is possessed, your father is a drunkard, your family, they are all useless. Your whole generations are grossly useless. How? A stupid girl like you. Do not ever. This will be the last time. Don't ever call me honey again. Am I understood? Yes. Look at this imbecile. This fool, moron, oh. bitch, a loca bitch. What was I even thinking? Was I hypnotized? Obviously, I was possessed. Because I cannot even look at you and imagine you to be my wife. A slut. Animal. Netwit. Do not in your miserable life call me honey again. If you call me that name, Mark my words, I will kill you with my bare hands and face the consequences. G, 
Chica, mm -hmm. why did you remove my baby sis from where I hung it to another place? And who do you think you are to ask me that stupid why question? Would you, why would I ask why would you? Ask this me? is my baby sister's house ah. and I have the right to ask Oh, you. really? Let me warn you. This should be the very first and last that you touch my baby's things. And I will not tolerate it. Benita, let me also warn you that the next time you try to talk to me in this manner and so on, I will fling you out of this contemporary defense. <laughs> you will what fling do you me. think you are? You will I fling will me. Throw you the out. day you will try it, that's the day you will find out I was born mad. Oh, really? Yes. Let me tell you also. Tell me what? I'm the only one who's mad. Really? I, I'm also going to show you that you're not the only one who's crazy. Eat you. What will you do? What will you do that you haven't done before? I will disfigure your face. You will not and dare! I am dead serious. You Don't mad. ever. I'm mad. Are you mad? How dare you? Did you not hear me say? Don't you ever! Lift your filthy hands of yours on me again! Don't you ever! Don't you ever! This is a check of 20 million now. Okay. I want you to take it and leave. You can start a new life wherever you want. Maldives, Dubai, wherever. Listen, I could double it if you want. I... I just want you to be happy after all. 
dare you? How dare you? Charles! Really? How, how dare you make a mess of what I have for you? You dare to make a mockery of the love that I have for you? Really? You want to pay me off? You want to pay me off? Oh my God. I can't believe this. Charles. I thought we were in this together as a team. I am here because you asked me to stay, to stand by you and fight for this and fight for our love. And you suddenly turn around to want to pay me off after all my sacrifices. Really? Okay. I think I think uh, this is where I have to give up. Of course. Because I cannot continue to be where I am not needed. You obviously do not want me here anymore, so I have to go. But I don't need your money. I don't need it. Look, I made the sacrifice that I made to you because I love you. I gave you my kidney, not, not because of your freaking money. I gave it because of the love that I have for you. It's not your fault. I should have seen the signs earlier. I should have seen the writings on the wall. I should have left you when the ovation was high, but I didn't. I stayed back because you asked me to. Fine. I don't see any reason I should be crying over this. Okay, good luck. I want you to be happy too, okay? But get out of my sight now. All I seek is care from you. Someone now care for me. All I need is true love. How's the baby? Slipping. All right. I'm glad you're back to your senses. I knew you would come back to me. I knew it. I don't want to waste your time. First off, um, I'm sorry for all the bad things I did to you. All right. Secondly, this is a check of 20 million naira. I want you to get yourself a new life. As for the child, I can comfortably take care of him. But if you insist on leaving with the baby, who am I to stop you? After all, he's still our child, isn't he? Of course he is. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. But I'm not leaving. I'm sorry. Just you think you can bribe me with this? You come here to tell me about this? You think you can bribe me? Oh, wait, wait, wait. So she sent you to me to come and bribe me? Come on, Charles, come on. Can't you see that I love you? I love you more than this. Listen, it's not about money. That, that's not why I'm here. I truly, truly love you, Charles. And I mean it. 
well, thank you very much. Keep our money. We need it in the future. Idiots! to bring in another, another woman into this matrimonial home while I'm still here. That will not happen. Shameless he could. Did I hear you well? You heard me correctly. I said, shameless he could. You just called me a he could. Isn't that what you are? Or are you better than a he could? In my own house. So what? Amaka, you got me a ego. That is what you are. In my house. In your house what? In your house what? That is what you are. I will you are not even ashamed of yourself. I will kill you you brought in you that thing. You are bringing in that thing into you this house. Oh, okay. I am ashamed of you. You are okay now. Why did I even see you in the first place? What madness is this? I will kill you here in this house. Stay one place, let me kill you. So you will do what? I will kill you. Go and kill your fellow men outside. So you will kill me. Go and kill your fellow men outside. Stop exercising your power on a woman. Just remain there. Let me come and do the needful. I am remaining here. Come, there, on. come and do the needful. I am remaining. That is evil. what you are. Why are you, you are a hypocrite. Oh, shameless that thing. Right. You disgust that me. The sight of you disgust me. You want it. Shh. Where is she? Veronica! Useless woman, come here! Stupid woman! 
Mama, is everything okay? How can everything be okay? Eh? How can everything be okay? Wicked woman. Mama, why are you calling me names? What did I do? Put that pretest! Put it! You know what you did? Look at you. You are pretending like you don't know what you did. You don't know what you did. Eh? You have been playing on my son's intelligence, on my son's emotion, all this while. Common wedding! Common court wedding for five good months. You've been turning him around. <laughs> Mama, did you just call it common? Uh -huh. You called it common wedding. Common court wedding. Oh, it's common, but your son refused to do it for nine years. Nine good years I was begging your son. He did not do the common court wedding. Now you're frustrating my life for just five months. You want me to do it? Sharp, sharp. Is it now you're, you're hungry for it, okay? You are sick. Hey, Mama, Biko, hold it there. Or is it your talk? You want me to enter your side? You have the guts. You have the F1 tree to bring this, this stupid face of yours into this house and beg me. No, we need to do the cat ready. So my son can travel abroad with you. In your mind, now I'm a fool. In your mind, now I don't have sense. You that don't like me, Mama, you despise me from the hey. beginning of me stepping into this compound. Now you're, begin, you're, you're being nice to me. As, hey, I know. You want to kill me. What? Yes, that's why you're being nice. They say when your enemy wants to get you, they, they, they become very nice. You want to kill me and take over my visa. You think I don't know that's what you and your son wants to do? You want to strangle me in this house and bury me here and take over my visa? Hey. Yeah? Jesus, my son said this. Please don't mention you are... Jesus' name in that matter. Eh? My son said that you are wicked, you will sue, devil. Eh. I did not believe. Oh. Mama, you were not informed too. Hey! Uh -uh, uh -uh. Mama, you were not informed too. I'm the devil himself. Look at me very well. Ekwensu. I'm Usu. That is what I am. Say that's what you call me. That is the names you call me. Oh. But you, you are the queen mother of all devils. Ah, you didn't know. You didn't know I can, I can call you names. Mama, listen. If I begin to call you names here, eh? You just find somewhere and kill yourself and die here. And nobody will see your corpse. Look, look at you and your son. You want to travel abroad with me. You and your son want to travel abroad. Let me see you people move. Listen to me. And listen very clear. I will leave this country with my children. They will become citizens of that place, of United States. You see, you are your son, you remain here, you be in Nigeria, you die here. Hey. Go to cross border. You think I don't know your plan? You think I don't know your plan is to send your son across to come and meet me. And then when you people have frustrated my life there, he will come and bring you over. So that two of you will strangle me there. Or probably divorce me and take over everything. Because he doesn't have shishin. He doesn't have anything. I have a good paying job. Try me and see. So you have been pretending to say, Hey! Ka so This girl is a witch. So na Hey God! Keno! Hey! What do we do now? It's alright, okay? I pray we'll be all calm down. Okay? I just pray that everything will be fine. Ibuka. Prayer cannot change my husband. It cannot. My husband is a beast. I watched Obiora change from a human being into a monster in my before. Listen, I know Obiora has temper issue. That I know. Okay? But this that he's doing now is what I can't really tell. I can't really vow for this. But don't worry. I will talk to him. You will? Of course I will talk to him. He's my friend. Please. It's only if it's the last thing you do for me. It's all just, right. it's all right. just help me talk See, to we him. are going out now. Okay? okay? I will talk to him. We'll talk over this. And everything will be fine. Alright? I will talk about it. What? Ebuka. Obiara. What is it? Let me just go inside and change. You're already kissing and caressing with my wife. Obiora, stop that! I'm your friend! I can't possibly do that! Are you mad? Obiora! Amaka! What are you doing with him? Honey, nothing. Nothing! Nothing! But I saw you hugging him! No. I saw both of you hugging him! Obiora, nothing! She was only explaining something to me! Explaining something to you? Of course! Listen!
abs. Sorry. I love her. I'm sorry. Please. Please. Forgive me. Forgive me. I will not do it again. I will not hit you again. Please forgive me. For the last time. Please. 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 Don't die on me. Don't die on me. Please. Stay alive for me. You know I love you so much, right? Huh? You know I love you so much, right? I love you so much. Please, I'm sorry. Don't die. Don't die on me. I'm sorry. Please. I love you so much. I'm sorry. Sorry. Please. never leave. Loser. Yes, this house was never meant for you. Yes, Chica. Me, I am the owner of this house. Yes. You can now leave. Loser. Loser. I fought a good fight. I fought well and I won. Move, loser. <laughs> loser. <laughs> Oh well, you can now leave. Yes, everything belongs to me right now. No sense. I fought a good fight and I won. You, you, you came to compete with me. Benita, me. No sense. This is mine. This is mine. Benita. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I fought a good fight and I won! A sacrifice for you. But you took me for granted. I did it for you. Don't be alright. Don't be alright. Can I walk again? Don't be alright. Hey, hey. Okay. No problem. I. I am sorry I disappointed you all. Papa, please forgive me. I, I kept quiet because I didn't know how to go about it. How am I even supposed to tell you people that I cheated on my husband? Before our wedding night. <laughs> so I carried that burden. Amaka. Amaka, I understand you. I can feel your pain. I know what you're going through. I also understand the reason you couldn't say it to anyone. Okay? But I mean, it's not enough reason for him to want to kill you. Goodness, look, 
I'm not trying to say that what you did is right. It is condemnable, I know. But your life is more important to us. We are your family. And we love you. Okay? So if he cannot forgive you, then it's better he returns you to us. Let him move on. Mm -hmm. Not kill you. Papa is there. We're all here for you. I'm so sorry. Okay? That bastard. Let me see him anywhere close to my house. His name is not supposed to be Obiora. Obi Ekwinsu. Vampire. He did this to my daughter. Okay. If Obiora has any problem with my daughter, he's supposed to talk to me. Oh. Man to man. Oh. Why should he beat up my daughter this way? Why? We are not saying what she did is right. But if he can't forgive her, bring her back to me. Oh. Eh? What kind of problem is this? Uh, uh, Amaka, go inside. I will handle this, okay? Sure. I'm sorry. Hi. Hey. Hi. This beating is too much. Vampire. It's too much for one human being now. Vampire, you could see he is not pure. His name is not supposed to be pure. I mean, if she has done something wrong, return her to her parents. The parents are here. We're, we're here. Okay, really, I don't know why you're yelling because yelling will not solve anything. Veronica, tell me where you hid my kids and tell me that I'm yelling at you. Where are my kids, Veronica? Where are they? Well, if you care to know, my kids and I are leaving this country next week. You, not even your mother, can stop us. Hey, be <laughs> I'm living with my children. Be calm, you stand it in them. Home. Veronica, please, forgive hmm. me. Forgive me everything I've done to you. Please forgive me. Do not leave my son like this. Please. Mm. Mama, please, please, please. With all due respect, hold it that there. Oh. Then you can talk. I can hear you. Because it's still the same thing I'm saying. Forgive me. Don't leave my son like hmm. this. Hmm. Mama, I should not leave your son. You always say, he's my son. He's my son. I will have to control him. I have to do this. Mama, this is your son. I am tired of this son. You can carry him now. Eat your son. As a matter of fact, we are in your son's house. This is your son's house. Take everything. Mama, you see this marriage? Or anything that comes out of it, I am tired. Hey, Mama, continue. Your son. Your son's house. Take all of them. Okay, need that now, beggar. Hmm. Beggar. Eh? Beggar. Do you, know, do you know how much I love you? Hmm. Do you know I love you so much? Hmm. I, I can't do without you. Please. Can, do not leave me. Uh, please. Uh, uh, uh. You can do anything, but don't touch me. Please, uh, do not leave me. Please, I, I need in my life. If you leave me, I can't survive it, please. I'm begging you, please. Hmm. This life, eh? So this is how table turns. Eh? Ken, you're kneeling down. You're begging me. Ken, do you realize the only reason you're kneeling here, begging me, is because I'm traveling out of this country? Because you want to go with me. Ah! Jack Bastrongo, look at my girl. Almighty care. I'm the man. I bring in the money. I provide for the family. You have to slave for me. Da, 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 da. You're kneeling down. Mm. You're begging me. You're just wasting your time. Oh. Uncle, you're wasting your time. Because come next week, I am leaving this country with my children. Oh. Not even you, like I said. No mama can stop me. I'm going up now to pack my things. Getting ready to move. Mama, Mama please don't touch honey, me. Honey, 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 honey. Okay, okay. Mama, I, I don't think I can live without her. Look at you. She, she wants to leave me, Mama. Go upstairs now. Go and beg her. You know, I am a woman. No woman will want to destroy her own home. No woman will want to mess up. Her. Go and beg her. Go stand up. Go. Honey, my love. Honey, honey, honey.
Don't tell me you left your husband's house. Of course I did. Hey! Hey, Fomo! Who did this to me? All my daughters are coming back from their husband's house. Mama, please. Hey! Hey! Amaka, you still haven't told me what happened to you. What happened to you? Obiora almost killed her. Obiora did all this to her. Obiora? Yes! Amaka, Obiora did this to you. Ken, what are you doing here? Wait, wait, wait. Ah. Ken, why did you follow me to my father's house? Papa, please, I... I am sorry. Papa, I... Papa, please, I'm sorry. Mama, I am sorry. Uh, honey, I am here to apologize to every member of this family. I know I have made life hell for you for the past nine years of our marriage. But I'm here to retrace my step. Please, I'm sorry. Forgive me, please. Uh, Ken. Papa. For you, an African man kneeling down. I know that means a lot. I can see there are... You, you, you are back to your senses. But let me warn you. This is your last chance. Any more wrong move from you, you will never see my daughter again. And so also my grandchildren. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. Papa. Papa, that's your own forgiveness, sir. Because I've not forgiven this man. I've not, I, I've not forgiven, I've not forgiven, and I'm not forgiving him. I am the one who wore the shoe. I know how, what I went through in the hands of this man. For, 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 for good nine years, don't touch me. Don't touch me! Ken, how did I not try to make you, make you help me make this marriage work? How? Sorry. You were busy doing what, what, what you like, insulting and disrespecting me the way you like. Mama, we could have fun. Mama, 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 have fun. Mama, mama, leave me. Leave me. Uh, Ken, stand up. This is my daughter. I know you are hot. Okay? Please. Children are involved. The family name is involved, please. Let us resolve this. But it's, I warned him. Yes. If anything, I get any bad report from him again, you'll see what your father will do. You know me. Eh? Please forgive him. I've heard you. I've heard you. I've forgiven you. But you have to give me time. You have to give me time to come to terms with what is, whatever is going to happen going forward in this marriage. Okay. So, Kureba, just stand there. So, yeah. Who is this? Eh? Who is this? You? What are you doing here? I'm sorry. Eh? I'm you are sorry. sorry for what? Where are you going to? I am sorry. Obiora, actually, I'm sorry. Obiora. Obiora, the boxer. Amaka. The tiger. Please, Papa, talk to Amaka for me. Eh? Obiora, leave my compa. I'm sorry, please. You are sorry. Amaka, forgive me. You want to give me? Where are you going to? Amaka. Amaka, go back. Amaka, go back. Amaka, go back. Go back. I'm sorry now. I'm so, it was the devil. The devil is the devil. That devil will do it now. That devil will do it now. I cannot go anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Go inside. Stand. Stand. Where are you running? Stand. Stand now. Where are you running? Stand. It's yours. Charles, what in God's name are you doing here? What are you doing in this house? Young man, she's asking you, what are you doing here? You are the last person I expect to see in my house. Benita deceived me. She deceived us. The child is not mine. Ever since that child was born, 
have conducted three DNA tests and all test results proves I am not the father of that child. Okay, so what am I supposed to do with this information? Is that the reason you're here? To inform me that the child is not yours? I mean, for what? Why do I need to know that? I came to make amends. To okay. make amends? Charles, you wanted to pay me off. In fact, you offered to pay me off. It was a test. I did it to her too. But that's not why I'm here. Chica, I failed you. I failed you after all she did for me. I failed you. You didn't deserve to be treated the way I treated you. But right now, I have realized my mistakes. I'm here to make amends. Papa? Mama? I'm sorry for everything I did to her. I'm sorry. My hands were tied. I... I... I'm sorry. As a matter of fact, I am ready. I'm ready to to be with her forever. I am ready to make her my wife. Young man. Papa. Are you sure you really want to marry my daughter? There is no life without Chica. Without her, I would not be here today. It can you give me life. You give me everything. Baby. I know I've not been the best man. But I'm ready to be the best husband only if you allow me you mean everything to me you mean life itself to me <laughs> I want to spend forever with you please please thank you nothing else matters to me right now but you please don't say no please thank you Chica, please, don't say no to me. Please. Please. Charles! Yes. I love you. I love you and yes, I... I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Thank you. I love you. I love you so much. And you mean the world to me. Thank you so much, too, baby. I love you. I swear I'm never letting you go. Please don't. Never. <laughs> Like